Today we play Super Zelda Odyssey. This is Super Mario Odyssey, but Mario is Link. You have powers from the Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom like Ascend, which lets you ascend vertically through objects. You have fire powers, water powers, lightning powers. You can do some hilarious tricks to gain infinite height almost anywhere. And a bunch of enemies in the game have been changed to Zelda enemies. Thank you so much for watching, and I really hope you enjoy this video. In the skies above Peach's castle. So it's a bit funny that this game is actually Super Mario Odyssey, but instead of Bowser, we've got to get in here. I love when you replace models in games with other characters, that you have things like that where Ganon's head is sticking out from above his body. This reminds me a little bit of Super Pokemon Odyssey, which was also made by Just A Cupcake, where instead of Mario, we had Mario, but with Ash Ketchum's body. Okay, that link looks funny. Oh my goodness, and we actually have Zelda instead of Princess Peach. Oh my goodness, Just A Cupcake really went all out in this mode. And instead of Cappy, we've got Link's green cap over there. So all kinds of enemies have been replaced and one of the coolest things that have been added was something made by just cont 8 who is oh my goodness look at zelda's neck there what is up with her neck that is a scary neck there wow okay but that's so cool to see link's hat coming down like this but as i was saying one of the coolest things that you guys oh my goodness and the hat is actually flattened that's so funny but one of the coolest things that you guys are going to see is the abilities that link has in this game made by just cont 8 one of the greatest and most underrated super mario odyssey modders of our time he's also the one who made Super Mario Sunshine adding flood and the rocket nozzle and the hover nozzle and the turbo nozzle adding all of that to Super Mario Odyssey that was an absolutely incredible mod man people are just creating mind-blowing things in this game Okay, so let's get started with the game okay so we are a little link over here I love that we have our shield okay so we would just want to go and catch up to that cappy up there oh and we could do this hold on can we use our abilities yet Yes! Okay, we can get blown by the wind like that, which is kind of cool. Who are you? I'm Link. Don't you know me? I'm in this game. Hey, let's have Cappy join us because Cappy might be useful in this game. But wait a minute, this cutscene's going to look so strange. Because normally, Cappy comes up to Mario, not up to Link. And Cappy has a torn piece of Link's hat over here. <laughs> I love the way that Link is standing. It's like he just did a back workout and he really wants to flare his lats. <laughs> I keep forgetting that it's not actually Bowser in that cutscene. Oh, and there's little Zelda. Wait, why does she have her arms making an X like that? It's like she's ready to karate chop. So is Link. Hey, let's see. Oh, that hat looks a little bit big. It almost looks like Link can fit inside that hat. How about this? Okay, let's see. Let's have you transform. What are you going to transform into, Cappy? It is now Link's hat. Look at that. That actually looks so good. It's a bit big because I guess Link is a bit small. But overall, hey, that's pretty cool. Okay, so I saw one of the coolest things that we could do is actually use this ability right here to fuse somebody to us. Hold on, so come to me. Okay, and now, there we go, there we go, there we go. Look at this, we can get infinite height with this guy because we are just bouncing on this guy. Oh my goodness. Can we just go straight up to the boss with this? Let's see how high we can go. Let's just come up here and just skip that whole section down there because we don't need any of that. And you know what? We don't even need that checkpoint flag there. Let's just go straight to the boss. Wait, what if we just come up here? Oh, there. Wait, 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 wait. What's going on with the Brutals? Because the Brutals aren't who they normally are. Let's have a look at the Brutals. Okay, well, I guess now we're going to see them. Oh my goodness, they've all been replaced with Zelda enemies. Look at how cool that is. That's incredible. <laughs> the boss warned me there'd be a fellow with a mustache coming along. But wait, Link doesn't have a mustache, so who are they talking about? They call us the Brutals! All right, let's go battle the Brutals. Okay, so this is the first guy that we are battling against. And, oh, 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 he's got some kind of spiky hat. Okay, let's try this. Let's try this. Oh, oh, this guy's still going by airship. My beautiful airship is rude. Okay, we have a really cool attack that we could do here. We could go into this fireball. Okay, can I jump on him? There we go. We jumped on him. Okay, now let's just... Hey! Hey, I actually got hurt by that. I wasn't expecting that. Can I hurt you? Maybe I got to jump on his head. Come, come, let me jump on you. Okay, that's fine, that's fine. Oh boy, it's so weird seeing this speech bubble that says my airship, my beautiful airship is ruined because we brought that one Cappy ghost with us, so that's kind of funny. Okay, but that was a nice way to defeat this boss. You know, sometimes when we play a mod, I think, is this game, wait, wait, and this guy's still here. My airship, my beautiful airship. Yeah, because I just released him right there. Okay, let's just make our way up here because this is where we need to go. But yeah, I'm wondering if this game is going to be faster or slower than a regular playthrough of Super Mario Odyssey because we might be able to do a lot of cool skips. 
Okay, and guys, some of the creatures, the monsters, the mobs in this kingdom, I actually have seen them before. The chain chomps are absolutely terrifying what they have been replaced with. Just a Cupcake did an amazing job with this. So I'm really excited for you guys to see this because I loaded this kingdom just to make sure that the mod was working. And I was terrified when I saw what the chain chomps were. Okay, so let's see what this is now. Is Link gonna get up? Get your face up, Link. Oh my goodness, your neck! Are you okay, Link? That was a bit scary to see. And look at that. Oh my goodness, those moons over there from Majora's Mask. Oh man, that is such a great replacement for the Chain Chumps. And you know what? Oh man, the Chain Chumps. Majora's Mask was such an absolutely incredible game. I loved the game Majora's Mask so much. And you know what? I wonder if we even need to capture that guy or if we could just do that. Okay, we can just do that and destroy it. We don't even need to capture these guys, which is pretty funny. Okay, so yeah, let's just grab our first Power Moon here, I guess. That'll be fine. Oh, and the way that we spin around is a bit funny as Link. Okay, and guys, one of the coolest abilities that we have in The Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom is Ascend. So let's see if we can ascend up here. Wait, let me go over here maybe. Can I ascend up here? Come on, there's gotta- Oh, there we go! There we go, look at us ascending. And we can just pop up right over here. That's so cool, the way that you can ascend like that. Can we also ascend over here? Instead of destroying this, let's see if we can just ascend here. Can I do this? What the? Are you okay? There we go, there we go. Come up, Link, and... Look at that! And we can just pop up here. How cool is that? That lets you skip so much of the game. Okay, so let's try this. And let's see. Jump. Blow me! And the wind blows you a bit like that. Okay, now let's go to this first boss. Oh my goodness. Wait! I was not expecting you, but the way that you're moving around is kind of funny. It is going to be so much fun to see what these bosses were replaced with. Because some of them I have seen. Some of them I gave just a cupcake some suggestions. I was saying, hey, could you replace this character with this one? That'd be cool to see. Or replace this with this. I think that'd be cool to see. But some of them I just said, you know what? I think you have fantastic judgment and you'll be able to choose great characters. Wait, did I hit it? Oh my goodness, I can just run straight into it with the ball and it looks like I actually damage it. Wait, can I go into you? Oh no, I'm almost dead. I gotta run, I gotta run, I gotta run. I gotta run, I gotta go heal myself. Let's see, give me a heart, give me a heart. Nice. Okay, yeah, we've actually gotta be careful. Okay, what else can I do? You know what? You know what, let's try using this on you. There we go, I control you now. I control you, wait, can I just send you back into him? I'll go up. Now come this way, I can control it. What if I just hold it back like that and I go like this, hold on, let's get into fire mode. Whoop. I want my fire ability. Give me fire, there we go. Can I just run into you? Yes! Oh, oh, but I get hurt. No, Flake, you're gonna die! You're gonna die. Okay, you know what? I am holding that person with my ability right now, so that's why they can't move, which is so funny that the moon is actually just standing up there. This is so weird. And look, I can send it, wait, can I send it up and down? Yeah, I can send it up and down, but it can't go up and down very high. Wait, can I try and make it leave? Go, exit, exit. Exit, go over there. Go up high. Go down low. What if I release it right now? Release. Oh, and now it's trying to chomp around. Okay, now it can start to come for me again. Let's, oh boy, that's so funny that I could just, whoa, 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 whoa. I missed, I missed, I missed. Okay, let's try again. Whoop. Let's go like that. There we go. It's so funny that I can basically just freeze the boss. I can freeze the boss in place and I can just turn into a fireball. Uh oh! Whoa! That was so weird! I ran into it, I thought I defeated it, and then I thought, uh oh, uh oh, it's moving around in a weird way. Am I going to die? Then I released the fireball, and all of a sudden it got defeated. That's so weird that we defeated it with the fireball. It's so interesting to see how these abilities are programmed in the game. And thank goodness I did not die from that. I was worried that I might be dying, but there we go. We just got a multi-moon, so now we almost have enough power moons to go to the next kingdom, and it's so weird to see Link floating around like this. It's almost as if we're seeing Link in Super Mario Galaxy. I love that pose that he has. That is way too funny. Okay, there are still a bunch of abilities that we have to test, but there's also some other stuff around here that I want to test. Hold on, can I just uh, ascend up here? Possible for me to ascend up here? Let's see, and... Nice, 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 nice. That's so funny that you could just ascend up like that and make it up to here. Oh man, I am going to have so much fun with this. It's so fun to just be playing around with this and goofing around and seeing what you can do. Oh, and there's one other, actually two other things that I really, really want to try. And then after that, we're just going to see what happens. Okay, so with these guys, you can obviously just go into fire mode and knock these guys around. Have these guys basically destroy all these blocks that are around here. We can send this guy into there. Oh, oh, get in there. Get into that hole. Get into that hole. Come here. Come here. I'm getting you into that hole. Get in there. Why won't you? Get in there. Man, it's actually a bit hard to aim. 
It's actually quite hard to aim. I think it might be easier to just grab this guy and drag him in there. Wait, is he not in there? Where are you? Go there. Go. I thought something would happen if I get you there. Let's release you. Okay, I guess that didn't work. Okay, something that we could probably do instead of using the moons to break this is we could probably just get in ourselves and get that power moon. Chomp through the rocks. More like blast fire through the rocks. Okay, and that should be enough power moons for this kingdom. More than enough, actually, just because I was doing some fun exploring and testing some stuff out. It's so weird seeing those moons in the background. I think they are so incredibly creepy. That is part of what makes The Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask so creepy. But it is such an incredible game. It has to be one of my favorite games of all time. Absolutely love the game. I have to get a playthrough of that game up on my channel. I played through it once a few years ago. So next up, we are going to the Sand Kingdom. Look at all of the little details that have been added to this game. Even the checkpoint flags have been changed to be Triforce symbols like that. You know what? I'm really wondering something because normally you want to rush over here so that you could catch up to the bird quickly. But what if I could actually just grab the bird? I wonder if we'll be able to do that. I really wonder if we can. Okay, let's see. Let's come on over here and get me up here. Now, where's the bird? Can I grab the bird? Ah, I didn't grab it. Oh no, I didn't grab the bird. Oh no, that is so sad, so sad. Okay, let's see. Can I use this guy to help me grab the bird? Help me catch the bird. You've got to go catch the bird. Okay, wait, we're talking to him, but wait, wait, wait. Come to me, come to me. And now, go lower. There we go, there we go. We can go and catch the bird. We can definitely get enough height to reach the bird. You know what? Let's forget about that bird. Let's just go over there. We could go get some power moons or whatever later. Let's just come on over here. Let's bring this guy with us. This is such a strange way to move. You could just use these guys to bounce on. Okay, now then. You want to start going down? Let's come on down with him. And... There we go. No, 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 no. Come down. There we go. Okay, we grabbed this one. Perfect, perfect. That's exactly what we need. Now, can we float up some more? Let's see. Let's see. There we go. Now we're starting to bounce on him. Yeah, because you can basically move this person to right under you. And they follow you. So... Wherever you go, they also go. So you can just go like this and bounce along. This is almost like a moon jump code in a way. Okay, let's grab this one. There we go. That's nice that we got another power moon on the leaning pillar. Okay, come on up. Now we can just go along here. I wonder if we could bring these guys inside with us. Wait, 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 wait. That's right. And what is this guy going to be? Whoa. I could go and ride on this guy, I guess. Okay, wait. So let's go like this. Let's just leave you there. Take this checkpoint flag, we'll get this, we'll get some coins, we'll get this power moon. And I think that is enough money so that we could ride on this guy. Let's have a chat with him. How you doing? I'm what you call a jacksy. You wanna ride? It'll be 30 coins. You're short on- wait! Oh there, now I have enough coins. Okay, that's so weird that you actually have to wait for your coin count to go up when you open the chest like that. What? You're doing some sightseeing? You gotta check out the inverted pyramid. Okay, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's ride on this guy. And... That looks so cool! Riding on this guy is so cool! Okay, we just ran into a Koopa Troopa over there. But is there anything that you actually want to do with this guy? I can't remember what power moons you actually want to get with this guy. Okay, because we could destroy that ice, but... Oh, oh, you could destroy the ice. That's actually pretty cool. Oh, I guess you can't destroy that ice, and we fell off and we died. Wait! Wait, 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 I have an idea. Oh, no! Don't push me off, Jaxi! No! No! I wanted to put him below me so that I could jump on him. That didn't work the way that I thought it would. Okay, so let's see. Maybe I could bring this Jaxi with me somewhere. Let's see. Where can we go with this Jaxi? Go like this. Gonna come along with me, bro? Let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh, this is gonna be so cool that I could go and ride the Jaxi wherever I want. Let's come on. Oh, oh, oh! I can't use a cappy while I'm like this because the cappy buttons are what make him move up and down. I have to be careful with where I bring this guy. Oh, so maybe I can't bring this guy all the way up there. I was hoping that we'd be able to bring the guy all the way up to the top and we'd be able to face the boss with this guy. I don't know if we could actually do that. Hold on, because if we get this guy under us, if we get this guy under us, then I think that we'll just automatically ride him. Like, if we bring him over to us here... See? Okay, right now he's just kind of pushing us back. And... Yeah, right now when I move, he just kind of pushes me. Yeah, this is a guy that you can't really bounce on, unfortunately. We can put him down and then we can ride him wherever we want if we take him to somewhere, but it's a bit difficult to take him to somewhere. 
And that, we can just break ourselves with the fire ability. So that's cool that we can just break right through that. Wait, did I get the power moon that was over there yet? Oh, and you know what else we could do? We could probably... Whoa, 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 Look at what the bullet bills are. They are these bat guys. That's so cool. So I could probably bring this guy with me wherever I want. Come to me. I could make him come up like that. And wait, did I explode him? I didn't explode him, did I? I think I just exploded him. Yeah, because if I release him, he explodes. Oh, that's too bad. I was thinking that maybe we could bring those guys to somewhere. Bring them somewhere nice. Okay, let's go here. And it's so cool that those flags, they have the Triforce symbol on them. Okay, so where we want to go is over here. Very nice. And now then, let's just get up onto this wall because there's a power moon or two that we could get over here that would be nice. Let's just go like this. And then that power moon just spawns right over there. That'll be a nice one to get. And... Can't see where we are. Okay, let's just grab one of these bats in a moment. Come on, shoot out a bat for me. Thank you. Now let's just quickly, hey! Hey, we were supposed to fly across to over there. You know what we could do though? There's something else that we could do because we don't actually need to fly. We don't need a bullet bill to get up there. What we could just do is come over here. Oh, and look at this, look at this. Instead of little Goombas, Look, there are just a bunch of these little rats over here. It's so funny how many of the enemies have been changed. Okay, now let's just go to ascend. Because from here, we should just be able to ascend straight up and make our way through. The oh, I already did get that power moon. For some reason, I thought that I didn't. Okay, but we didn't get that power moon there, so we could go get a power moon back there later. Now, where else shall we go? I guess we could go and make it up there. Got a bunch of these little guys here. Ah, oh, there, friends. Let me up here. Hope you don't mind this. I don't think we need to pull that down. I don't think that that is important. Let's just go here. Oh, and you know what we could do? After we grab this power moon, we can probably just ascend up. Let's try that. Let's see, can I ascend? Oh, maybe we can't ascend because we are not on ground. Because we're sinking like this, so we probably can't ascend. That's probably why we can't ascend. Okay, that's actually kind of interesting that it didn't let you do that. Okay, so let's see if there is a nice way to make it up here. Can we just ascend up here anywhere? I don't think that this tower really sticks out, so I don't think that we would be able to do- Wait! Oh! Okay, apparently we can! Okay, I was thinking that we wouldn't be able to just skip up through that, but it looks like we can. That's cool that we were able to do that. Lovely. Okay, now we just need a nearby NPC that we could grab and climb onto so that we can make it to there. But do we have anything else that lets us fly? Not really. I don't think anything else can really help us. Okay, we could just come down here because I know that if we talk to this guy, then we could get through. But wait, wait, wait. We can't just squeeze through here, can we? No, there's no way that we could just destroy this guy, right? Yeah, we definitely can't just destroy the Sphinx. I think we actually have to answer his question. He wants the ring. Hey, thank you for letting us through. And you know what? Speaking to a Sphinx does sound kind of like something that Link would do in a Zelda game. You know what? I'm curious. What if we ascend in this room? It probably will take us to some kind of out-of-bounds place. Because there's got to be a ceiling in this room. But let's see what happens if we try to ascend right here. Let's try and ascend. And? Wait. Where am I? Where am I? What? What happened to Link? Oh! Oh, and then all of a sudden we fall down here. Okay, I guess it just takes us a while to fall down. Okay, something else that I'm really curious about is if we could ascend around here. Let's see. And we've got to be able to ascend around here. How high do we go? Okay. We're ascending. No way! We made it up all the way to the boss. Through the pyramid? That's unbelievable that you could just make it up all the way like that, okay. So let's just grab... Whoops. Let's just grab this one here. Want to keep Cappy spinning there. And now we can get this power moon. That'll be lovely. A nice power moon to get. And let's take on the boss too while we are here. Maybe we'll have something interesting that we could use on the boss. Maybe we could try grabbing. Maybe we could try grabbing the boss. Okay, now let's see. Which one are we going to be facing this time? Ah, I wonder who it's going to be. Is it going to be the one on the far right or top right? Which one could it be? Okay, it is this one. Okay, yeah, because that one does seem a little bit girly. Okay, so let's go, let's go. Can I just grab you? I don't know if I can. Okay, let's send that back to you. I'll just jump on your head. There we go. Okay, that's a nice easy hit on you. Wait, can I grab you? Ah, uh, it doesn't seem like I could grab it. That's too bad. Wait, wait, wait. I wonder if I could use... 
this ability on it and make it freeze, because I think this might freeze or electrocute it or something. Let's see what this does. If I can use this on you, let's see. Oh, that ability doesn't seem to work on you. That's too bad. Okay. Makes sense, because it is kind of a boss, so it makes sense that some abilities might not work on it. But let's see, is there anything else that we can do? We could use this to just give ourselves a wind blow. Oh, go. Whoa! Whoa, 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 whoa. That wind's still there and still strong. Okay. Let's see, where are you coming next? Just come here. Oh, you're too fast! You're too fast. I couldn't get you like that. Okay, now let's see. I'll just use this now, so even if you hit me... Whoa! Whoa! That was one of the coolest things I've ever seen! If you use the water bubble, the attack just bounced right back onto it. That was so incredible! And do we get a multi-moon for that? Yes, we do. Oh, that's so nice, Kate. I'm still in the water bubble. And it looks like my water bubble stays there during this cutscene. I just pop out of the water bubble, but the water bubble just stays down there. Is it still down there? Let's see. Will we get to see it? No, I guess the water bubble is too far down, maybe. Okay, so we still need four more power moons, so I think this shouldn't be too bad. We should just go- Hey! Look at these guys that are coming out here! Oh man, those are kind of creepy. Okay, so let's come up here. If we could get the bird, that'd be nice. If we can't, it is not the end of the world. But let's see, is the bird around here? Where's the bird? Where's the bird? Come here, birdie! Yes! We've got it! Very nice! Okay, so that's nice that we got that one. Okay, we need three more. So there are, hold on, how many more are there around here? Okay, I think that we can get this one right here, so that's one. Then there's one down the pipe over here. Then there's just a hill that we could ground pound up there. And that should be all of them. Okay, and actually over here, there should be something nice that we could do. Hold on. If we swap to fire, I guess when we roll over it, it'll appear. Wait, does it not appear when we roll over it? Is it this spot or top left? Let's see. I would have thought it'd be... Yeah, it's here. Oh, but that's so weird that when we went into the fireball, it didn't work. I would have thought that the fireball would have created enough damage so that it would appear, but I guess not. So maybe for this other moon that is around here, I think it's on top of that hill up there, actually. Maybe using this actually won't work. Let's see if it spawns or no. Maybe we have to... Wait, I thought it was around here. Where is it? Oh, there it is. Okay. Yeah, so I guess maybe the fireball doesn't cause those to spawn. Okay, but now we have enough power moons to go to the next kingdom, so this is going to be exciting. Oh, man, it's so much fun going through this and not only testing out these abilities and seeing what wacky and broken things you can do, but also seeing what the enemies have been replaced with. Okay, so let's go to the lake kingdom first before we go to the wooded kingdom. Okay, so here we are. Oh my goodness, guys, guys, guys. This is something that we were thinking was a good idea. Replacing these guys with Zoras because doesn't this seem so much like the kind of kingdom where you would see Zoras, the lake kingdom like this? Okay, and there's obviously a shiny spot here. Let's see if we can do this. Let's see. Will this do anything? No, even if we make fire over here, even if we turn into a fireball, we don't make that spawn, which is kind of surprising, isn't it? Okay, but a nice spot that we... Whoops. Wait, wait, can I move this? If I could move this, that would be unreal. Let's see. I can move this! That's so cool. Okay, come to me. I'm a bit lower. Can I just bounce on you? Yes! Okay, we can get infinite height on this thing. How weird is this? Oh, 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 oh. And you guys can already see what these enemies are over here. Look at these, it's like a bunch of little legs coming towards me! A bunch of little legs are coming towards me! Stay back, legs! Oh no! Oh no! Come, come, come. There we go, there we go. Okay, let's come up here. Let's come up here. We can just go up here and get that power moon up there, even though we normally shouldn't be allowed to get that. This is such a weird way to play this game. It's like, you can just put an object inside you, and then once you have that object... Okay, wait, let's grab this, there we go. Seek your path to Lake Lamote. Yeah, and then once you have that object, then, uh, yeah, you could just use it to bounce anywhere. Wait, can I use it from here? Whoa, that's so weird. Now I could have views from a different location. You're not normally supposed to be able to have a view from here. Another thing that I guess I could do is I could grab this, bring it close to me. Let's bring it down like this. Let's come up high like this. Come on, come on, keep going, keep going. Oh, 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 maybe there's an invisible ceiling over there because it's not letting me go any higher. Hold on, what if we come over here with it? What if I catch it? I go like this, and... Oh no, I wanted to catch it! Okay, well, I accidentally triggered the boss fight, so I guess we're doing the boss fight right now. That's what we're doing. So who are we facing off against? This guy, okay. 
Doesn't seem like it'll be tough. He's so creepy. Doesn't he look so creepy? He looks like just such a creepy boss. I think a good ability to use might be water. Yeah, because if we use water, then we don't get hurt by that, and we can bounce on this guy, which is great. Now, wait, wait, wait. What if I stay in the water like this? What if he comes to me? Hey! Hey! Water is supposed to make me invincible! How are you still damaging me? What is this? What is this madness? Okay, wait. Am I safe now? I don't want to die, because I have only one HP. Well, that's nice that we did that. Let's come over here. Bounce on his head. That's nice. But now, I do want to stay away from him. I'm actually scared. I'm actually scared. I'm at 1 HP. If he kills me, then I have to redo this boss fight again. That would be bad. That'd be very bad. Okay, where are you? Go. Oh, thank goodness that worked. Okay, we saw a little water jet there. Can I get onto you? Can I get onto you? Let me onto you. There we go. Okay, this guy is defeated. Man. And this looks like something out of Roblox Doors, doesn't it? Roblox Doors has some pretty creepy stuff. Wait, 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 can I grab the Power Moon? Oh, I was hoping that- Oh, look, that object is still up there. The thing that you can use for looking back and forth. Okay, but we got the Power Moon. Too bad you can't grab the Power Moon and move it around. That'd be funny to test out what you could do with that. I love the way that these links run towards you. How cool is that? And you know what? Let's even capture one of these. Look, I am now one of these links. Look at this. How cool is that? I am one of them. I am one of them, let's go, let's go, my Lynx, let's go! Ah, they're hurting me, that's not good. Oh, and look, there's a Zora that's fishing on the cloud over there, that's also very funny. Oh, and you know what else we should be able to- Whoa, 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 that is a big fishy fishy over here that Dory is replaced with. Let's just grab that Power Moon there, that's very nice. Dory back rider. Oh man, and wait, wait, wait. Look at what Cheap Cheeps are replaced with, that's pretty cool. Those things- Oh, don't kill me! Come in here, get that. Okay, very nice. You know what? I have an idea for something that we can do. I want to try this. I really want to try this because I think this would be a great idea. Okay, so normally, you could use this Scarecrow. Well, let's first try it normally first. You throw this on there and then you have to run to there. So normally, you throw Cappy onto this Scarecrow and then you have to make it down there and collect the Power Moon before it disappears. But that might be difficult for some people. So here's another idea. Here's something that you can do. You can bring this guy with you. Hold on, can I come down with him? Yes! Yes, 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 yes. Let's bring this guy down. Come on down, come on down. Come on down, let's leave him. Hey! Hey! I wanted to leave him here. Can I not leave it underwater? Hey, maybe I can't leave him underwater. Okay, so here's what I'm gonna do. I'm just gonna bring him a little bit closer like this. Can I drop you off here, though? No, I can't drop him off there, though. That's so weird. This thing is so strange. That's actually so surprising. I would have thought that I'd be able to bring this guy closer, drop him off. Yeah, for some reason, this guy just doesn't want to move at all. Doesn't like being underwater. Yeah, but we could still just do ground pounds like this and get to the power moon in time like that. Now we have enough power moons again. And if we come in here, we can see that this is just the city of Zoras over here because there are, of course, Zoras over here. Which is very fitting for this town. So next up is the Wooded Kingdom, which... Seems kind of fitting for Link, but for some reason, this kingdom always reminds me of Sonic. Oh, and these are some scary looking enemies. Man, Zelda games have no shortage of scary enemies. Oh, and you know what? We- wait, do you hear something? Yeah, I do. Hold on, is there gonna be a nice way to catch that rabbit? What can we do to catch that rabbit? Maybe we could do something like this. Can I freeze the rabbit? What if I do this? See if this does anything. Aiming at the rabbit and... Oh, maybe that attack does nothing. Do I have another attack? What if I use this? No, it doesn't look like this attack does anything on the rabbit, too. I think I can freeze or electrocute some other enemies, but I don't think that it works against the rabbit. Okay, let's try this. Blow me towards the rabbit! Wait, did I zap the rabbit? I think I might have zapped the rabbit. Yeah, look, look, look! Some electricity is appearing around the rabbit like that, but it doesn't look like I'm really... ...freezing it or anything. Maybe this doesn't affect the rabbit. Oh, there we go! Yeah, I actually... Wait! I thought I froze the rabbit. Wait, how come the rabbit's still running around after it's zapped like that? Well, anyways, that was a kind of glitchy rabbit. That was a weird rabbit. You know what? I think buying a Power Moon will be a good idea. I'll buy the Power Moon and then I'll take the Shopkeeper with me too. Okay, so there we go. We took the Shopkeeper. Now, can I take you with me? Hold on. I'm guessing maybe I can pick you up if we do this. Let's see. Okay, maybe after this I can move you. Let's see. No, I can't move you. Okay, maybe I can take this guy with me though. This guy that's spinning around. Let's see. Yes, I can bring you with me. Okay, perfect. Okay, now let's see. Bring you down a little bit. 
Perfect. Okay. Now we can start to bounce off these guys. It's so funny that you could just capture these guys and then you could climb on up like this and get to the very top of the kingdom very quickly and very easily. Because we just keep gaining height like this because we keep bouncing on this guy because this guy is basically right below us. You know what? You know what? Let's come down here a little bit. Okay. Perfect. Okay. That's what we need. Now hold on. You can come on up. Come on up. Okay, now let's just release them right there. Perfect. We are programmed to grow flowers. The flowers are programmed to grow. Okay, now we just need this one. That's very nice that we got that one. The nut that grew on the tall fence. Kind of weird to get that one as one of the first power moons in the kingdom. You come to me now, and there we go. Let's just gain some more height. Where else shall we go? I guess we could go up to the top of there. This is a nice way to have a kind of exploration mod in Super Mario Odyssey. It's almost like a moon jump. Because you can just get to whatever height you want and very easily get there. Now, let's see, where else shall we go to? I guess we could go over there. Oh, but I wonder if anything's going to be up here right now. If we go over here, is the boss going to be here yet? I guess not, right? Because normally, you're not supposed to be here, are you? Okay, you're just talking about flowers being programmed to grow. But over here is completely empty, which is kind of surprising. Nobody's here at all. What about up here? Let's see if we come up here. Oh, there's actually an invisible wall that's preventing us from going here. I can't move forward right now, which is kind of surprising. Yeah, maybe if we go high enough, we'd be able to make it in there. But that's actually kind of funny that I can't make it there right now. Okay, so let's just come to this boss right now. I'm going to bring you to the boss, okay? All right, your little flower program guy. Come, come, come. You're going to come with me in here. Okay, let's just leave you there, okay? You just wait there, okay? I'm just going to... Wait! The boss doesn't even want to battle me right now! I thought when you come here, you're supposed to trigger the boss fight, but I guess that doesn't trigger the boss fight. Hold on, let's try going through this area here. Wait, I wonder if I actually have to first defeat that piranha plant down there before that boss will want to battle me? Or can I just exit from there and come in here and then the boss will want to fight me? Because let's see if they'll want to fight me now or not. They might not want to fight me yet, and... No, they don't want to fight me! The boss fight doesn't get triggered! Wow, that's actually so surprising. And my guy that I used to come over here is gone because we went through a loading zone. So now where am I gonna go, huh? Wow, that's so sad. We lost our friend. I guess we'll go this way. We could just come down to here and now we should be able to defeat these enemies quickly here. Do I look like plant food to you? I guess so. Yes, you do. I guess that's why they ate you. Okay, now let's just get onto this guy. He's defeated and there's a nice quick power moon for us. Okay, and now we should be able to take on the boss. We could probably just take the quick teleport to the boss and take it on now. Okay, so I know that there's another power moon just around the corner here. Oh, oh, and look at these guys. Look at these guys that come out. Oh, wait, but there isn't one over here. There's one over there. But wait, let's see. Can I get this first? Oh, let me up here and give me the power moon. There we go. Okay, we got it very nice. The nut at the dead end. And it looks like there's some stuff down here that we could get to. Wait, 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 wait. I actually want to try something. This is a cool idea. Okay, let's try grabbing this guy. Wait, can I not grab this guy at all? Yeah, we could grab him, okay. Bring him to here. Can I put you down or no? Yeah, now we can put him down. Weird, okay. Now that opens. And wait, wait, what if we bring this guy into here? And then we take it. Let's see, let's take the hat back. That door closes. Now what if I capture this guy? Because normally you're not able to do this. Wait, what the? That's so weird, I threw Cappy at him and he was just defeated and now I can get the power moon, but now what? Fire in the cave, that's so strange. And wait, can we exit through here? Now I can't exit through here, I have to throw Cappy at that. And that's what unlocks the door. Now we can go like this and Cappy's gonna come back to me, so now no one will ever be able to go in there again because the scarecrow is going to be on that side. Come to me, Cappy, come to me. Cappy going to come to me or no? Uh, maybe it's not on a timer. Maybe it's just based on distance only. Yeah, there we go. Now Cappy's coming back to me. Okay. Oh, and you know where else we want to go? Oh, wait, but first, let's look at these guys. Hold on. Look at that! Look at that! How appropriate is that? Because I thought that those guys, even when I saw what they originally looked like in Super Mario Odyssey, I thought that they looked like those Deku characters from Zelda games. So I thought that is the perfect character to change that into. Okay, now let's get through... Here. Don't bonk. Good. We made it through. Very nice. And wait, what are fuzzies going to be? Because there are fuzzies in here. Let's see. Oh, that is so good. That's so good. But these guys are so scary. So let's just get up here. 
Very nice. We got that power moon. Okay, now we have to just go get the other power moon. Weird, I normally take damage when I'm over here, and I'm actually playing pretty well. And we took damage. We took damage. We took damage. That's okay. That's okay. That's okay. Oh, I want to swap to something else. Get me up there. Get me up there. I was thinking of swapping to the water ability just so that we could defend ourselves quickly and maybe we wouldn't take damage. Hold on. What if we have this on? We get hit by one of these guys. What happens? Look. Okay. Okay. It looks like for a moment you don't get hit. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do, actually. Okay, you know what? Let's get out of here just so we don't die. That's enough testing that. Let's do this. I've got an idea. Let's come here. Go here. We'll go to this. Then we can ascend up here. Then, whoa, whoa. We're going through a weird thing like this. Just like in... Z Wait, how high is it going to take us? I don't think that we have to go up this high. Don't tell me we're not stuck in here forever, are we? What the... Oh no! Oh no, it brought us down into this area. I actually didn't expect that it would bring us down. That's kind of funny that that's how it worked, okay. Now I have to find my way out of the deep woods because I actually don't want to be in the deep woods. Wait, I can't just ascend up from here, can I? We're not able to do that, are we? Is this for planting something? Probably. Okay, now are there gonna be dinosaurs wandering around here? Oh boy, now we've gotta make it out of here. A bit scary. Wait, are there enemies here? Snakes! Or wait, are those snakes or are they mice? They look actually just like little mice. I think I overreact. Okay, there's a dinosaur. Dude, that guy doesn't notice me. Oh! Oh, it's a little Deku Link! Little Deku Link, what are you? What is this guy? Oh, oh, it's a coin coffer! How cool is that that you could be this guy in the forest? I love these guys. This... Oh boy, from The Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask, that's what that is from, which was, oh boy, one of my favorite games of all time. Absolutely loved that. Pull the lever to receive a seed. Okay, thank you. What? Wait. Do I hear something? Can I hurt if you move nuts? They can push you in a weird way? Let's see, what if we ground pound that? Is that one safe? That one's just coins, that's okay. Maybe this one is a... Wait, is this the thing that you have to throw coins at for it to grow? I wonder if that's the one. One safe or no? Okay. Also dangerous! Also very, very dangerous. Now wait, is this just gonna grow immediately? Okay, nice. Let's just climb up here then. Let's just climb up here. Let's get out of here. We spent enough time... You know what, actually? We should get at least one power moon while we are here. Or at least try to. You know what they say, get a power moon or die trying. Could this shiny spot have something? There's gotta be one shiny spot that has something good. Come on, guys. Okay, I'm just gonna keep this water around me. Maybe it'll protect me and save me from dying because this should protect you from one hit unless it gets used up quickly and then you get hit right away after that. Wait. What's this? This is a rock to move of some sort. We move this. We could get in there. What's this? Is it just purple coins? It's just four purple coins! I don't know if I even got those in my regular playthrough of this game yet. Anything nice in here? You know what? I see a dinosaur. Don't hurt me, Mr. Dinosaur! Don't hurt me, Mr. Dinosaur! Please don't hurt me! The shiny swap pack, though. I wonder if that's the one that we need. Let's see. The dinosaur can't be that fast, can he? He won't catch up to me, will he? Where is he? Where is he? Back there somewhere. There's no way he's gonna get us. Okay, what's in here? Is it just coins? It just coins and then you run through the tree? Come on, there, there's gotta be a power moon around here somewhere. I remember there's one tree that we have to go into and then there are some treasure chests or something. Okay, that's enough. Let's get out of here. Oh, hold on. I think, if I remember correctly, there's a power moon around here that you could get with one of these guys. You just have to basically climb up here. We get onto this, then up here, there's gonna be a nut somewhere. This was a funny place to end up, I guess. Yeah, it's right here. There we go. That's a nice one for us. And it heals us, which is great. Now, wait, wait. Can I hold on to this guy or no? I'd like to hold on to him. That'd be great if I could. Hold on to you? Yes. Yes. And now. On. Perfect. Perfect. I could use this guy for gaining infinite height like this as we make our way back to the level where we wanted to go. Let's just continue on this way. Oh wait, and I also could just teleport to the boss fight since I have unlocked that now. But wait, 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 I wonder if we could enter that through the bottom. Can you enter that through the bottom or is that closed over there? You guys know what I mean? This tower over here? Let's see if we could do this. 
see. Ah, no, it's blocked off like that, so I actually don't think that we could get up through that. Let's see. Almost no way that we could get up through that. Uh-oh. I'm come down. Come back up. Let me through here. Oh! Ah, you can hit them and get the... Get coins from them. Look, I can hit these and get coins from them, but we can't break through. Oh, that's too bad. Oh, well, hey, it is pretty cool that we were at least able to do that, I think. Okay, well, there should be one or two cool power moons around here. Okay, you know what? Let's just leave that guy there. I guess I could... Oh, I guess I could capture this guy here. And now maybe if there's something that I could stretch up into and destroy, then I could do that. Wait, I don't know if Captain Toad is actually going to be here, though. Let's see. Let's go like this, and... Oh, I might not be reaching. I don't think I'm reaching. Wait. Come on! That was so close! Okay, but we're not reaching anyways. Okay, let's just teleport up to the boss fight since... This boss does want to battle us now. I think that would be cool to see. Okay, and the boss is this guy. Whoop. Okay, so let's... Okay, I got hurt. That's okay, that's okay. A okay, pretty cool looking boss now comes... What in the world are you doing? What in the world are you, bro? What are you? Okay, let's knock his hat off. Jump on him. There we go, okay. Good boss fight so far. Now just come here, come. Get ready. Oh, no. That wasn't a jump on him. Okay, let's get ready. Oh, that wasn't a jump on him also. Whoa! -oh. I've got to jump on him. Got to jump on him. Let's see. Oh, don't come here. Okay, let's just knock his hat off. Knock his hat off and then just jump on him. There we go. Okay, the last hit wasn't perfect, but that was a pretty good boss fight. Man, in some ways, this still looks and feels very much like Super Mario Odyssey, but at the same time, so much has been changed and it makes it a very different game. The enemies are different, the abilities are completely different, the character that you play as is different, but the worlds are the same and the locations of the Power Moons are the same. Okay, and it looks like my game actually crashes after defeating that boss, so we are going to have to get different Power Moons. It's like so cool. Get in here. Okay, nice. We can get in here. It's so weird doing this from the top instead of from the bottom. Okay, but nice. We were able to get that one. Now we just need to grab one of these nuts and bring him up high. Where's the nutty guy? Where's the nut? Where's the nut guy? There's one there. Like this. Grab you. Come. Come. There we go. Okay, we've got you. Come to me. And come down. And whoa! We're going up fast. Okay, and you know what? Go like this. And come down and wait where are you there we go okay nice and we got the power moon. okay that was such a strange way to get that one i never thought that i would get that like this whoa oh whoa, whoa, because i'm about to use that blowing ability i was wondering why was there water up there it's because this ability over here lets us get blown by some wind just like in the legend of zelda tears of the kingdom oh wait <laughs> But how am I going to make it back up from here now? Because I never activated the button that makes this path form here. Let's see if we can get out of this. Let's see. Will this work? I go like this. Oh, this might not work. Okay, you know what? I'll just try just a long jump. No, there's no way we're making it to there. Unless... Unless this is the area that brings us to the deep woods. Yeah, I think we're making it into the deep woods. So, hey, at least we didn't die. And, you know, I probably should get a power moon here. Can I get something up here if we move this? Come on, come on. Tell me there's a power moon here. Tell me there's something nice here. There we go. Wait, no, no, no. Get the power moon. Come on, Link. What are you doing? What are you doing? Why are you going back into that tree? You're not a Christmas decoration, Link. Get off of that tree. Can we get a power moon from giving this just a bit of money? Or do you have to give this a lot of money to grow? I think this might be the one that you have to give it a lot of money to grow. Hopefully I didn't stop just before getting the power moon. Okay, well, we should be able to do this one. Wait, you know what's another thing that we can do? Hold on, hold on, hold on. I've got to try this. I have to try this. I think this will be a great idea. Let's bring this with us to up here because it should be somewhere around here, I think, that it spawns. And this would be fantastic if we could get this to work. Okay, so let's go like this. You down there. Okay, and... Oh, yes, yes, yes. That worked perfectly. That is way too funny that we brought that right to where the power moon spawns. And we could just grab it. You obviously have enough time to get the power moon. Oh, and you know what? This is actually an all right way to uh, farm some coins. You just go like this. Throw Cappy on that. And just keep collecting the power moon. And then you can just keep getting a bunch of coins like that. That's so funny. 
Okay, I didn't see the secret room with the treasure chest, so let's go back up. We need three more power moons. Okay, let's just make our way up this slope. It's nice to make it up this slope over here. Should be nice. Oh, oh, I know that there's one nice power moon that we could get down there. Hey, bro, 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 bro. Come on, let me down, let me down. Bro, move, move. Bro, come on, come on, stop this, bro. Oh, it's because he's trying to extend out, I think. Okay, here, I'll let him go then. Now, let us through here. Okay, that's exactly- Wait! Why can't I throw Cappy at that? Can I not activate that? Before I defeat the boss or something? What about in here? Can I go to this door or also no? Let's see, can I go here? Okay, I can go through this. That's so weird that we couldn't open the last one, but we can open this one. That's- Oh my goodness, look at all those little links standing there. That's so funny, okay. There should be one or two power moons that we should be able to get to around here. Let's see, hello there, little Lynx. Hello there, little Wind Waker Lynx. There we go, just defeating you guys. Don't mind me. Don't mind me. Please just don't follow me here. Don't follow me here. Don't follow me. This is not Instagram or Twitter or anything like that. Not social media. Do not follow me. Okay, now let's go this way. And it looks like those guys are no longer following us. Okay, and we want to, of course, jump over that because we don't want to go into the poisonous floor because you die if that happens. Oh, and now, of course, want to... Make some nice jumps like this. Okay, there we go. Oh, let's get that off of our screen. Wait, do we want to make it up to there? I guess we... Oh, oh, oh. I was thinking that we just have to make the jump up to there from here. But it looks like that is not necessary because we can just continue up like this. And I'm feeling like there's probably a power moon that I missed. But hey, at least we got this one. That's fine. Flower Road Run. Wait. Yeah, there's a power moon right up there. Huh? How can we get to that? You know what? I think we're gonna die right now. Yeah, we're dying right now, but that's okay. Yeah, the power moon's just right up there. How in the world did I not notice that before? Am I supposed to just capture a bunch of these guys and then we can go high enough? Is that how it works? Let's see. Oh, yeah, this does seem like quite the easy way to do it. Yeah, because then we can just pop out like that. Look at that big stack of links that helped out this link. That's so funny. Okay, but yeah, now we can, of course, just get out of here. And it's nice that this is spawning back here, so now we could use this. And now we can just exit through here. And now that we are back in the main kingdom, there's one more nut just right down here, I believe. And if we just get that right there, then we can get this power moon. Now we can teleport back to the Odyssey and get out of here and go to the next kingdom. This was probably the longest kingdom yet, just because... Well, a big part of it was because we had a problem with that one boss. So there were basically a few extra power moons that we had to get more than normal. And normally that boss is a pretty quick multi-moon. Okay, so now the game says that we're going to the Metro Kingdom. But of course, we're not going to the Metro Kingdom first because we are going to be attacked by Bowser first. And we're going to be in the Cloud Kingdom. Oh, that's right. It isn't even Bowser that's going to be attacking us. It's going to be Ganon that is attacking us. It's so funny seeing Link come to the window like this. It's Ganon's airship. But he has a bunch of Bowser paraphernalia on it. <laughs> Link's face is pretty funny. Okay, are we going to get to see Ganon right away? What is Ganon taking? Why does he have a bunch of Bowser flags? Mount Ganon! We're here to save Zelda! Oh! That actually looks pretty creepy. Look at him. Ah! He looks so small. Link looks so small because I guess he has to be the same size as Mario. But normally Mario's a bit wider. Alright, let's make our way up here and we are ready for our first battle against Ganon. I guess the game started with a battle against Ganon but now this is one that we actually have a shot at winning. Oh and I wonder if any of our abilities will be useful here. This will be really interesting to test out some of the abilities. Uh, hello Ganon, I'd like to battle you. Link, I don't have time for you. I'm busy planning my wedding. Don't you know how stressful that is? Wait, Ganon doesn't want to steal Zelda because he wants to marry her. Does he? Oh, and that's so funny. You actually see Zelda instead of Princess Peach in this cutscene. Look at that. Wow, she has some very... She has some collarbones that really stand out there. Oh, and Ganon's hat is actually so funny. That's so funny how his head floats above him like that. Okay, now let's see. Which power-up do we want to use? Let's use water. Happen. Oh, nice. Does it just bounce off me? I'm not sure if that's because I used Cappy or if it's because it hit me. But... Oh, boy! Whoa, 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 I had some weird movement there. Oh, and Ganon was sitting in a weird way, too. Oh, and that's it. Okay, I thought that we'd have to do some more jumps or something. Okay, but let's just go like this, okay? Now, wait, are you gonna... No, you don't blow fire, right? I think you're just gonna throw some cappies. Okay, so let's see. 
Go like this, and... Wow! I don't even have to throw Cappy! It actually just gets destroyed when it comes in contact with the water, which is so funny. Okay, now let's see. What else can we use on this guy? i try using this on you. Oh, this ability, it looks like it doesn't work on you. Okay, I was hoping that we'd be able to use some kind of cool ability on you or something. Wait. If we use water... Oh, no, it still hurts us. That's not good. Wait, wait, and we still have our water around us, so that's kind of funny. Kind of funny that we have our water around us. But you know what? I think I am going to keep the water. I think that's a good strategy. I like having the water around me like that. If I grab one of those taps, I can grab this cap! Uh-oh! 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 Oh, oh, no! Oh, no, oh, no, oh, no. Oh, no, wait. What if I bring this cap to me? Will it hurt me? What the? I Am I wearing this cap? What's going on? What's going on? Let me move. Let me move. I can't see what's going on. That was so strange. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. That was some weird stuff. It almost seemed like I put on that purple cap instead of it hurting me. Let's go. Okay, now it's time to take out Ganon. Wait, and let me... I want to put on my water shield. Maybe I can't put on my water shield while I have this cap on top of me. Okay, but there's Ganon. Knock back onto the ship like that. Zelda looks kind of upset. I like the eyes above Zelda's head because that's Cappy's sister. All right, Ganon, what are you going to do now? You're kind of upset about that. And the hat disappears once he puts it on. His legs aren't even fully connected to him. Fire! <laughs> Uh-oh, now Link is running away. <laughs> Link, why don't you just use your shield? Use your shield, that'll help you. Oh, and there's Zelda with her extended neck again. See what you're up against, Link? You're up against the power of the Triforce. And we now end up in the Lost Kingdom. Wait a minute. I wonder if I could pick up that globe and take it with me. Hold on. This would be super interesting if we could do this. Let's see. Wait. Why is everything shaking like this? It's not normally shaking like this. What's going on? What's going- what in the world is going on? This is so strange. I've never seen anything like this. Hey, wait, is this the one that we're supposed to jump onto? I think this is the one that we're supposed to jump onto. Okay, and we should be able to do a cool jump from here. Let's see. Let's see. I messed up! Blow me! Okay, let's see. We should be able to make a nice jump. Through there. And just get me up here. Perfect! I was worried that we would bonk and fall. Wait, what are you? Oh, look, 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 look how cool that is. It's like a little heart. Let's drop down now. Oh, that didn't even, uh... Explode all the... No, bro. What can I even do now? Oh, that is so sad, so sad. Because since we died and we didn't get a checkpoint flag, we respawned from here. So now I actually have to make that jump again. And that jump can be a little bit tricky. Let's see if I can get it again. Look. I don't know if that'll be high enough. Why aren't you grabbing the wall, bro? Surely we will get it this time. It's just so weird that all those bushes are bouncing like that. I don't know what is going on. I've never seen that happen before in my life. I'm pretty sure I haven't. There we go. That was easy. That time we didn't even have to do the wall jump. Okay, now this time we're... Definitely making it across, right? Yes, there we go. Wait, I probably could have just used the fireball to blast through that. Let me see if we can. Let's see, let's do this. And? Yeah, we could have just used the fireball to blast through that. And you know what? I might just stay in fireball mode now. Let's do this. Let's stay like this. And we should be able to make our way up here. Wait, I wonder if we can just ascend here. No, probably not because there has to be something above us to ascend to. It's so weird doing wall jumps like this as a fireball. Wait! It looks like you actually can just ascend here. Hold on, hold on. Let's just get... Hey, wait, wait. Let's get rid of the fireball so I can actually move around properly. But hold on, there's a moon here, right? Yeah, here's the moon. And hold on, hold on. I'll grab that just in case. I don't think we need that, but hold on. Would we have been able to just ascend to here? Let's see. Hey, maybe we can't ascend because that's too high. Because it looks like I actually can't ascend from there. Which is kind of surprising, okay? But... We get this butterfly, that is the question, let's see. Come on now. Come on now. And... There we go, we got it. Perfect. Got the butterfly, very nice. 
A butterfly's treasure. You know what they say, one man's butterfly is another man's treasure. Wait, that's not how the expression goes. Well, regardless, we can get this power moon, a top, a propeller pillar, and there are just so many quick power moons that you could get in this kingdom. You can just get down right there, then you could come here, ground pound here, grab another one. Oh wait, hold on, hold on. Let's have a look at some of these enemies. Wow, look at that, look at that. Oh, and look at these guys. What in the world are these things? Wow, interesting. It's interesting how many Zelda enemies there are here. We collected half of the power moons we need. Kind of surprising that we got that many that quickly. Doesn't really seem like we did all that much all that quickly, does it? Well, nice that that guy's been defeated. I just don't. Oh boy, don't go into the poison. Don't go into the poison. Let me come here. Sure, let's grab that. That's very nice. Let's just come on up this way. And I'd love to get that power moon right there. Now, don't die, don't die, don't die, don't die, don't die, don't die. Oh, man, you didn't die. Good job. I'm actually somewhat surprised. Oh, okay, don't want to speak too soon. And okay, now, it'd be nice if we could just come here, go like this. Ground pound here, because there's one back there. Let's just use our fire ability to smash through those. Get this power moon. We don't even have to use these little heart guys over here to grab our happy and explode that because we could just use our fire ability to destroy it. Okay, let's grab this one here. I wonder if we could use our fire ability to destroy the cage or if we need one of these heart guys to throw Cappy at to destroy the cage. You guys will see the cage that I'm talking about in a moment. Hold on. Get up here first. There we are. It is right over there. Hold on. Can we make it over to that? Maybe if we go like this, we can make it over to that. Hold on. I don't want this guy to grab my cap here. Uh-oh, move! Rubber, 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 rubber. Can I defeat these guys or no? I don't know if we can. But like, this. Ay, 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 ay! Okay, but from here we should be able to make it. Right, right, right. Let's see. And, perfect. Okay, can we destroy it like this? Wait. No, it looks like maybe we can't. Let's see. No, I'm in the fireball, but we're not destroying it. Oh, that is so sad, so sad. So maybe we actually need those guys to do that. Or wait, can I just... I can't just go through here and get this power moon right here, can I? Can I just grab that? Oh, that's even easier! Okay, sure, I guess we don't even have to destroy that cage. Instead of destroying that other cage, we just went inside this stone cage. Now we have enough power moons. This is such a quick kingdom when you know where the power moons are. And when you don't have that bird steal your cappy, it's so cool to see the Triforce symbol on the checkpoint flag like this. That's such a nice little detail. I was a bit worried that the Metro Kingdom actually wouldn't load, but the Metro Kingdom did load, so that is fantastic. And look at that boss over there. That boss might be familiar to some of you who have played Legend of Zelda Link to the Past. It looks like it might be that one boss from there. Kind of looks like that. It might be from a different Zelda game, actually. Okay, so there's a cool jump that we can make to there. Let's see if we can do it. If we stay at about a 45 degree angle like that. And... And yeah, we made it! Whoa, look at these guys! Look at these guys, they almost look like they turn into the things that are almost like po-souls. I wonder if that's what it is supposed to be, or if it's actually something else. Okay, now hold on, how do you make this jump again? You have to go something like this. I haven't done this in so long that I actually don't remember how to do this. Okay, let's see. I'm gonna jump onto this. Let's see, then you can just get up- Oh, that's actually so much easier than I remember it being, huh? For some reason, I thought that that was a lot more difficult. Wait, am I supposed to get up here now? I'm not sure if I'm supposed to get up here now, or if I want to go over there right away. Let's see, let's see, what if we go like- Yeah, we should be able to get up here, but is there a reason to get up here? Oh, maybe you actually want to get up here so that you could jump to that one, but something that we also probably should be able to do is if we ascend, do we go up one level or two levels? That is my question. And, oh nice, perfect, it just brings us up one level, so that brings us up to exactly where we need to be. That is so funny, I have got to make some puzzles that make use of this, I think that would be so cool, using this mod. There are a lot of cool things that you could do like this, guys, if you have any ideas, let me know in a comment. Let's see, let's go here. Hey, no, we didn't make that, that is so sad, so sad. Wait, can we destroy this car? Uh-oh. Hopefully the game isn't gonna crash. Hey okay, guys, my recording just messed up, but look at this. When you're in the fireball, you can actually destroy the taxi like that. How cool is that? Okay, and 
Right there are some sherms, actually. So look at what we've got instead of sherms. Those things look kind of cool. They almost look like mechanical elephants, don't they? Okay, but now we can head up here. We've got these little young toon links over here. They've got hard hats on, but the hard hats look a bit big for them. I don't know how they know where I am. How are they chasing me? I guess they're listening really well to see where I am. And you know what? Getting that over there would be cool. Let's grab that. And am I falling now? Am I falling now? Go! Oh, yeah! We didn't fall! How great is that? Oh man, it's so cool. We got the power moon and we didn't fall. Wait, you know what else we could probably do? Can I ascend here or no? See? And? How high up can we go? Whoa! What in the world? I didn't think I'd, I'd ascend up that high. It almost seemed like I made it up onto Bowser's ship there. Can I ascend up even higher or no? Okay, it doesn't look like we can ascend up any higher than that. But... Can we get up anywhere from here? Oh, we can almost reach that. Almost. Can I ascend from here? Come on, let me ascend. Come on. Let's try ascending from here again. Get me up really high. Oh, just put me down, put me down, put me down. Wait. Yes! Okay, somehow I did make it up to here. Okay, that's pretty cool. Okay, we made it up to an even higher one. So we got to skip that middle section in there. And now, you can just go up here to the boss. Okay, that's nice that we were able to skip that one inside section, because that one inside section is pretty tough, and I think that there's only one or two power moons in there. So look at this thing moving around. It reminds me a little bit of Rayquaza, because in Super Pokemon Odyssey, this boss was replaced with Rayquaza, if I remember correctly. And oh boy, I remember my first time seeing Rayquaza in Pokemon Ruby when I first played that game. Man, what a game. Oh, and down comes Link. Look at that, lands right on his feet. His neck extends quite a bit. And he has a bit of a weird stance for these boss fights. Okay, wait, but let's grab these guys because we've got to grab these guys. And... Wait. Oh no, I don't know which one we've attacked and which one we haven't attacked. Oh, there we go. This is our chance fire. Okay, there we go. Looks like we damaged it a bit. That's nice. Oh, but this is going to be hard when this gets to a later point of the boss fight because I'm not going to know which of its which of its sections of its body we have and haven't damaged before. This might become a little bit tricky soon. You know, this hat actually fits so well on top of this enemy that we've captured right now, doesn't it? You know, let's see, where are you going? Coming through one more time. Okay, come on, come on. That's enough, that's enough. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Come on, come on. What face are you going on to? Where are you going? Where are you going? Coming here? No, nope, you're coming over here. Okay, that's fine. Okay, I don't really care about these things. I just want to attack you. Let's just see. Let's just see. Just let me attack you. Hey, okay, come on, come on, come on, come on. Get the heart, get the heart. And... Let's see. Which of its pieces haven't been attacked yet? I can't tell which of its body parts haven't been damaged yet. That's not good. That is not good. That could prove to be troublesome. Can I use water? I don't know if I could use water while I'm in this guy. Okay, wait. Let's just shoot that. Shoot that. There we go. It's so nice that you could collect something by shooting it. Wait, and are you coming back up again? Yes, great, great. Okay, amazing. Okay, now which of your parts have not been hit yet? That is the question. Oh, 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 I can see that they're kind of electric like that, so those have got to be the ones. And? Did I get them all or no? Oh, that one, that one, that one, that one, that one. Did I get them all now? Yes, yes. Come on. Come on. Come on, we should be able to finish it off. There we go, thank goodness we finished it off. Okay, that could have been much worse than it was, because it wasn't very obvious where we had to hit it, because when it's the normal boss, the colors are a bit different. And it's easier to tell. But that worked fantastically. And when we played Super Flood Odyssey, when we played this game with Flood, we explored what happens if you run away from this area during the boss fight. And some wacky things could happen. So if you guys want to see that, I really recommend watching that video. And it is now daytime in the city. Time to go collect some power moons. Oh, and moving through this city is going to be so much fun. We have Ascend. We are going to be able to use our hand to control some people. Wait, I wonder if... Oh no, it doesn't look like we can move that. I thought that'd be kind of funny if we could just move that. Okay, but hold on. Power Moon right here for us, which is a nice and quick one for us. Secret Girder Tunnel. Wait, can I just ascend out of here? What if I ascend out of here? Yes, ascend up. Just a little thing like that. That's such a funny way to make it up like that. Okay, and can we still make this jump? This jump is a little bit tricky to make. Let's see, and... I don't know. Yep, that's making it. That made it. Let's go. Very nice. Okay, now, is there something nice that we could do to jump rope easily? You'll get it next time. What do you mean you'll get it next time? Duh. 
Come on. You know what? Maybe we'll take one of these. I don't know if we will need it, but let's take it just in case. Let's bounce up here. And we should be able to plant this right... I missed! Okay, whatever. I don't care. That's fine. That's fine. Well, that's a bit in the way, isn't it? Wait, wait, wait. I wonder if we could do this, because normally, you want to get this car in there. Go like this. Now, let it go. Wait, wait, wait. Now, what if I just capture the guy? Do I get the power moon right away? Oh, my kid's so good at this. Bro, you got the power moon right there. If we capture him, then... Yeah, we get the power of it right away! That's so funny that that works! Oh, man. Okay, let's see if we could get up here like this. Nice job getting up there. Thank you very much, sir. Okay, now let me up here. Now, there's some garbage that we've got to get rid of here. Wait, wait, wait. Can I use my fire ability to get rid of this garbage? Can I use this? No, it looks like we actually do have to ground pound to get that one. Okay, but that's nice that we got that one. Who piled garbage on this? And there is going to be a power moon that we could get right here by just flicking ourselves in that direction and land right on the bench, right in place. That's so cool. It's almost as if it's perfectly designed for that. Link looks tiny compared to this person now. Because normally that's Mario size, so Link looks tiny when he's shrunken down to Mario size. Okay, let's go. Wait, 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 wait. I was going to say, let's go. Uh, I take you. Come. Wait, am I controlling her right now or no? Ah, uh, weird. You'd think that you could control these people, but I guess they're- Whoa! Where are you going, my bro? Bro, come back! What the- Yes! No! Come back! Come back! Where are you going? What's going on? What's going on? Because these people, they're, they're stuck on some kind of, uh, rails? Yeah, these people are set to follow a certain path called rails. So that's why when you go to capture them and try to make them move in a certain way, they might not necessarily follow. And yeah, their movement is a little bit glitchy, which is kind of funny. Okay, but yeah, we got this one. And something funny that we could do is, of course, ascend up here. It's so weird that we could just come through it like that. Wait, can I ascend up here? And I know that there's also a nice power moon that we could get inside here. We could get a nice quick one. I will play your game. I'll play your game. For 10 coins, of course, I will play. Okay, and let's try and get all of them at once. Oh no! I completely messed up. I completely messed up. Okay, let's try again. Let's try again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll get them all at once. I'll get them all at once. Okay, it's after the red heart. That's when you gotta go. Wait. After the red... Wait. Oh, it's after just the regular red heart. Not after that one. Okay, so let's see. Go now. Okay. Oh, I didn't get them all at once. If only I had shaken the controller. But there we go. Now we will get the power moon if I can just get it. There we go. We've got it. You know what? Maybe I could grab one of these people that are sitting down. Maybe that'll work. Let's see. What if I grab you? Yes! I could take a sitting person with me. Come. Come to me. Come here. Now come down. And... There we go. Okay, and I can just climb up these people. It's so weird that I can do this. I can just take this sitting lady. Just bring her up here. Oh, I can make her go sit beside somebody else, actually. Oh, and this could actually be a good way to climb up to the top of these buildings. This could let us get nice and high. Okay, because down there we could go get a power moon. Then we can... Power moon over here on our way up. Where's this power moon? Okay, there we go. We got that one. That's very nice. Glittering above the pool. Okay, that's a lovely one. Oh, and we could go get that one over there. But first, let's just make it up to the very top because I know that there's one at the top of this tower over here. What a strange game we are playing. What a strange, strange, strange game. Oh. Let me down and get that one. Very nice. Dizzying heights. Okay, that's fine. Now let's just come on down over here. Help me to down here. Okay, let's see. And just let me down here. There we are. Oh, wait. Let me uh, bring you up a little bit, actually. Hold on. Just have a seat there for a moment. I just want to get this power moon. Thank you very much. Yeah, you just have a seat on that garbage over there because I can't throw Cappy while I'm moving you. Okay, so now I need you to come back. Come sit here. There we go. Okay, now let's continue. Let us continue now. We shall go and collect the power moons that are necessary to collect. We can head this way. And you know what? I'd like to come down here because there's a spot to ground pound right around here. It is right around here somewhere. Oh, maybe over here. There it is. Thank you very much. And you know what? Hold on. Look, 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 look. There's actually empty spot... Right. Whoa, that was so weird. She just came out of the ground. I could just walk around like this. I could choose where to put her. 
just comes out of the ground like that. Okay, but, but, let's put her down like this so that she can have a seat with these people. Wait, I imagine that right now she's just hypnotized and she doesn't even realize what's happening. She thinks that she's sitting down there where she was earlier. But now she's just going to wake up all of a sudden as if she's just waking up from a dream and she realizes that she's in the wrong spot, that that's not where she was sitting. She's now part of this conversation. Actually, she looks a little bit worried to be here. She thinks, wait a minute, how did I end up here? These aren't my friends. I can just swap one of these people with another. Look, this guy's trying to have a conversation. I don't think he's really paying attention to his conversation part. Take this. Oh, <laughs> I can just make him float up. Woo, goodbye. And then just leave him up there. And he's still having a conversation as if his friend's right in front of him. Or this guy, I can just make him go, woo. He just goes underground like that. Are you ever on a date and you just think, you know what? I gotta get out of here. Whoop. And then you just hide like that. Okay, I think there are two quick power moons that we can get in here, if I remember correctly. Two or three. Or maybe even more. Wait a minute, I've got an idea. I've got an idea. Oh, wait, wait, wait. This might actually not work since these people are moving. Like, if I try and grab one of these people. Yes, you're actually listening to me. Okay, come. There we go. Okay, I could just climb up like this. Come, 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 come. Come on, let's go up. Come on, come up, come up, come up. The lady's like walking. What's going on with her? Hey, okay. there we go. That's what we need. Wait, wait, what if we put her down here? What is she going to do? Come back up. Let's put her down right here. Whoa! She just disappeared back there. Wait, is she walking the wrong way now? Wait, I'm being moved now. Oh, never mind. It's just because the people. Look, that one lady's walking the wrong way. Where is she gonna go? Where is she gonna go? This doesn't happen. Normally all the people are walking the other way. What's gonna happen to this lady? Where is she gonna go? What's gonna happen to her? Oh my god. Oh, she just turned around and started walking the other way again. That's so strange. Okay, but we do want to pull that down. And we want to make it to that power moon. Before it disappears, which I think is... Kind of easy, isn't it? That didn't really seem too difficult. Okay, but I think we can also go through this pipe, and where does that take us? Oh yes, that brings us to here. Okay, and there should be one or two easy power moons that we could get here, and then after that, we only need one or two more. I wonder if Ascend will be useful here, because I know that I'm pretty sure there is a cool jump that we could just make from here. I think we could even do a triple jump here. If a triple jump works, then a round pound jump will probably also work, but it might be better from here, since we could also use the wall. Let's see if this will work. Go like this. And... Let me up there! Hey! Alright, we got it! I wasn't sure if we would actually make that one, but yeah, we got it. That was nice. But I'm not sure if any parts of that building stick out over where we are, so I don't know if Ascend will really help us out. But you know what? I can think of another nice place that we could go and get a power moon. Wait! I've got an idea! I've got an idea! I have a really good idea! Okay, here's what we're gonna do. Okay, first, let's just get... That checkpoint flag right there. Let's have a chat with the mayor. The mayor says, hey, I need you to gather some musicians so that we could have a show of some sort. So let's do this. Yeah, I could grab a musician. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, no, 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 no. But I actually don't want to talk. I just want to grab him. Uh, I was hoping that we'd just be able to grab him, but grab and talk is the same button. Uh, I was hoping that we'd be able to drag him along with us. Wait, now it looks like we have some kind of ball of light with us. I wonder if that's the drummer or if we're just holding some kind of empty placeholder that's meant to represent the drummer kick. Okay, pick up this. But I can't pick up the fire hydrant. I guess I could probably pick up the taxi car. Wait. No, it doesn't look like we can pick up the taxi. That's so sad. I'd like to get across to there. I know that you two are in conversation right now, but I've got to take one of you, actually. I'd like you to come along, please. Hey, come, please. Thank you very much. Hope you don't mind me using you like this. I'd just like to get across to this building over here. Thank you very much. You know what? I'll even bring you down here. I'll let you come down here. Down. Oh, no. She crosses her arms. Crosses her arms. Okay, you can come up here. And you know what? Here, you can have a chat with this gentleman over here. Here, put you two together. Like I'm playing The Sims right now and I'm matchmaking. I'm choosing who gets to be friends. There we go. You could stay there. Yeah, look at them hanging out together like this. That's perfect. Look at them. <laughs> I think they make great conversation partners. She just stands there and doesn't say anything. And he just keeps repeating the same thing forever. Okay, and that's all the power moons that we need. So now we can go on to the next kingdom. Man, I'm having so much fun with these abilities. This hand ability is so much fun. I'm so glad that I found out that you could bounce on characters like that.
Okay, so now we have a choice between the Snow and the Seaside Kingdom, so we are, of course, going to go to the Snow Kingdom first. Here we are, the Snow Kingdom, and wait a minute, there's a jump that is impossible, or almost impossible, to make that is back here. But you know what? If we use a sand, can we maybe reach up there, actually? Hold on, hold on, let's first see where this is. I know that there's something that- okay, if I could please just get up onto the Odyssey, even. There's something somewhere back there. Yeah, right back there. I don't know if we could possibly ascend to that if we get underneath that. Let's see. Where would we be? No, uh, I don't know if we could make it up to that. Let's see. Let's see. Let's just try to get out of this cold water. Maybe if we try to ascend here. No, can't really do any ascend over here. How about here? No, not seeing anywhere that we can ascend to, unfortunately. Hold on. There's a Captain Toad around here somewhere. Where's the Captain Toad? Is he in here? There he is! There's Captain Toad! Hooray! Link! Fancy meeting you! Captain Toad looks so much bigger than Link, this is so strange, because you'd expect that Link should be so much bigger than Captain Toad. And you know what I'm curious about? What if we use Ascend while we are in here? Let's see. Wait. Oh! Ha! <laughs> Just bring this up to there, then we slip. Okay, but... But maybe we could take this Captain Toad with us. Let's try this. Come with me, Captain Toad. Oh, oh, I thought that I decapitated him. I was a bit startled for a moment. Now, let's see. Let's bounce along on this Captain Toad here. And maybe we'll be able to make it up to that power moon that's up there somewhere. Well, where was that power moon that we had to make it to? Okay, here's this area. Now, where's the Odyssey? What way is the Odyssey? The Odyssey up here? Let's see. Let's see, nope, that doesn't look like the Odyssey. Where is the Odyssey? Let's see, okay, the Odyssey is just slightly to the right from here, so let's come up this way. And wait, is that it? Is that it? Yes, there it is, okay, so, now we could just ride along on Captain Toad, who keeps saying this kingdom is cold. We could just leave him up there, get that checkpoint flag, and we could get this power moon here, perfect. Path to Shiveria. Well, that's nice that we could get that, and now we could just leave Captain Toad there. Captain Toad could just stay there. We don't really care about him anymore. We got his power moon, and we were able to stop by here. Those were really the only two things that we needed him for. Oh, I hope I can make it up here without dying. That'd be nice, wouldn't it? We could get up here. Hey, will this work? That'll definitely work, right? Yeah, yeah, we could definitely reach that, and... We could get in there, into Shiveria Town. And wait a minute, I wonder if we could actually move these boxes on. I don't know if we could move one of these. Doesn't seem like we can move that. What about this? No, it doesn't seem like we can move that. Okay, wait, let's grab one of these people then. Come to me. Come here. And... There we go, we can just ride up on this guy. And get up to the power moon right there. That's perfect. We didn't even have to disturb those boxes. And yeah, we just left that guy over there. It's so funny that we could just move these people around. Eek, you scared us. Oh yeah? Yeah, I'll show you afraid. Are you scared of heights? Are you scared of heights? Because I'm going to put you up there. Oh, you know what? Actually, maybe we could use this guy to uh, climb up here easily and get to this because that's such a funny way to do that. Not the normal way of doing that, but it is a way of doing it. Okay, so let's come back down and stop by this shop, because in the shop we could buy a power moon. Hey, what if I bring the shopkeeper with me? Oh yeah, that's right, I think we did try this and I think that it didn't work. We did try to take another shopkeeper with us. Wait, they said, welcome mustached friend, but I don't have a mustache, what are you talking about? So we can get the power moon, but I don't think that we can move the shopkeepers, let's see. Yeah, the shopkeeper doesn't want to come with us, even though we tried to grab him. Hey there, would you like to come along for souvenirs? You've come to the right place. Well, you know what? What I want even more than souvenirs? I want you. That's what I want. That's right. Come with me. For souvenirs, you've come to the right place. Wait, so now wherever we bring this guy, he's just going to say that. For souvenirs, you've come to the right place. Souvenirs? You're in the right place. Yeah, this is where we need souvenirs, right here. This is the perfect place for souvenirs. I thought back... Whoa, and this guy really clears out the snow, even if we're, uh... Even if we're not really close to the snow, all the snow just got cleared. Did you guys notice that? I almost didn't even notice that. That was cool. Wait, is this the right place for souvenirs over here? Oh, oh, I didn't know this was the right place for souvenirs. I thought back there was the right place for souvenirs. I'll just put you... Put you on the TV over here. You're gonna be on TV now. You're gonna be on TV. There we go. For souvenirs, you're at the right place! It's like he's part of a commercial or something. Okay, let's go over here. Let's go get... Some of the power moons that we could get in these areas. So what's here? Wait! 
All of the snow is all clearing around me. That's strange. Are you gonna blow me up? Very nice. You know what? I actually don't really care too much for this area. So I might not even get a power moon here, because there's one power moon that's kind of off to the side, but it's really out of the way. So I might just go to some of the other ones, because we only need four power moons, so I'm not going to go to that one. So don't care about that one. Now let's just come over here. We should be able to get one or two here. I think we should be able to get both here. I don't think it should be too hard. Whoa! Whoa, both of these are changed. Okay, so that's the typhoon. Normally that's a typhoon. Wait, oh, and these are spinies. That's what these guys are. I was trying to think. I thought, wait, what are these things normally in? They're spinies. That's what they are. Let's come here. And can I get up there from here? I think I should be able to make it up high enough on that, right? Yeah, easily, right? Yep. And, whoa, almost fell off, actually, but there we go. Got that power moon. That is lovely. Up a blistery arch. And come here. Don't blow me off. And let's just grab... I grab you like this. Uh-oh! Uh oh don't blow me! Whoa! Whoa, his blowing didn't affect me. That was so strange. Okay, but now we've captured him, and now we can just blow off all these spinies. And... Oh, there's just one that wasn't defeated. Wait, and what if I just grab it? Move it aside. Now let go. Hey! Oh, I thought that it would fall. Okay, but then it fell. Okay. Now, we can just make our way up, and there we go, we've got this power moon, lovely. So we got both power moons in this sub-area. Okay, now I think the top and bottom areas on the right will both be good. We can go to either of those if we want two power moons. Now hold on, is this the one with the moon shards? Oh, it's this one, okay, this one's even better, I think. Okay, so let's just grab these links over here, because these links, the nice thing about them is that they don't slip on the ice, because they're actually Goombas. Okay, come here. And, there we are, now we have four, so we can activate that switch, which is great. Then we can just pop out here, grab that power moon, and then there's one other power moon that we need. Which will be right over there. I don't think we can jump straight to that from here, though. Ah, uh, let's just go like this. This'll be fine. Blow me. Wait, 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 that isn't air, that's water. Let's go like this. Blowy! And, oh, that's so cool how it gives you a little push like that, so from standing you can move pretty quickly. Okay, but that should be all the power moons we need for this kingdom, right? I think it is. Yes, that's everything we need for this kingdom. Okay, let's go back to the Odyssey. Next up is a kingdom that is much warmer, the Seaside Kingdom. You know what? And in this kingdom, I think we might be able to use Ascend a little bit, and that might actually be useful. Ah, there should be some areas that stick up a little bit, right? Like right here, I think we might be able to ascend up to this. Hopefully this isn't too high for us to ascend up to. Let's see. And here. Yes! Look at me ascending up here past those guys. Let me up, let me up. Come on. Come on, keep going. Keep going. Why'd you stop? Why'd you stop, Link? Keep going. No! Is that as high as the send will take us? No, tell me we can go higher than that. Go like this then. And? Come on, Link! We've got to go higher than that. Can we go from here? Uh-oh. Watch out for this guy. Can we go up like this? There we go! Finally we made it up! Okay, and we can just get this power moon right away. Alright, I was starting to worry that we wouldn't be able to ascend up there. Okay, and there's another power moon right up there if we can get to, uh... Captain Toad, but I actually don't know if we would be able to make it up to there. I don't think a send can take us that high. I think that might be too high up. Okay, so let's just make our way up here. Over here, even with just some regular jumps, we should be able to get to a decent height. Wait a minute, wait a minute! But it seems like all kinds of bushes and everything is acting all weird when I get close to it. Maybe that's what was happening at the Lost Kingdom Oh, nice, I made that jump. Maybe that's what was happening at the Lost Kingdom earlier when I was wondering, wait, why are all the bushes moving around? Maybe the same thing is happening here, and maybe the same thing was happening in the Snow Kingdom when all that snow around me moved around. Do you guys know what I'm talking about? I thought that it was... Wait. Okay, good, good, good. I thought that maybe the game would crash, but I guess it was just loading something. Wait, can I ascend here? Let's just ascend here so we don't have to do this puzzle. Nice! We can just skip straight up there. That's so funny. Okay, now grab the power moon. Very nice! All right. And wait, what if we use Ascend in here? Like, what if we climb up to here? Now use Ascend right here. How high do we go? Whoa! Is that the level down there? Am I gonna be teleported back somewhere? I hope so. Let me back. 
Okay, I guess maybe if you ground pound, then it just brings you back down to here. Okay, well, that's nice that we weren't stuck there forever, actually. Okay, so let's see where we are going to go and what we are going to do. There should be some stuff around here, I believe. Oh, 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 it's one of these guys instead of Dory again. Okay, so let's just have a chat with you. Oh, and maybe I'll be able to take somebody and go up high. Okay, so let's see, what do you have? What do you have, fabulous products? Sure, I'll take one of these, please. Thank you very much for that. There we go. Shopping in Bub Lane. Already have four power moons. That's very nice. Okay, now hold on. Now let me just take one of you guys. Can I take you, please? Hey, I'd like to take you, please. All right, the court cries out for sweet, sweet volleying. That's fine. Okay, well, you just get into your shell then. That's fine. And wait, do we want to get up here? Yeah, it looks like we want to get up here, actually. Right up here. Put you down here. Put you aside. Come on up. You can stay right there. That's where you can stay. Wait, you're still in your shell. Are you scared that I'm gonna attack you? I'm not gonna attack you anymore. I'm done attacking you. I'm not gonna attack you anymore. Don't worry. You can come out now. You wanna play volleyball? Yeah, you wanna play volleyball here, don't you? Not really the place for volleyball, is it? Let's just come down here. I think this just has a door. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Actually, here. Yes, it looks like we could just ascend up here. Okay, so that's perfect. We could just get through there like that. We don't even need to capture one of the guys. Oh, but now, look at these. These are almost like Zoras. Is this a type of Zora? It kind of looks like a Zora to me. I'm not sure if this is something else. Somebody who knows more about Zelda lore can correct me about that. I The first Zelda game that I ever played was The Legend of Zelda Link to the Past. I remember playing that on the... Uh, on the Game Boy Advance, actually, not on the SNES. I'm guessing it first came out on the SNES. Let's come across this way. Come down here, get some more water. And I think if we play this perfectly, then we might be able to get two power moons here. Let's see if we could just nicely avoid the poison. If we could just make it across to there and... Whoa, I barely made that. I thought that I'd have to jump out. Okay, but we did make it to this one, which is actually fantastic. Oh, but you know what? If we don't make it, maybe we can ascend from down here. But you know what? It might actually be too high. So we, yeah, that's definitely too high. There's no way we could ascend up that high. Because it seems like in this game, ascend has a bit of a limit for how high you could go. And it doesn't look like from here you would be able to use ascend. Yeah, we can't use ascend from here because that ceiling is way too high to reach. Cool! So we already almost have enough power moons. We just need three more, actually. Oh, oh, and look at some of the fish over there. They actually look much more menacing than cheap cheeps. They kind of look like sharks, which is a little bit scary. Now, where is the treble clef? There's a treble clef around here. Oh, there it is. Perfect. And it is right before the rocket flower. So let's just grab this. Now, we should be able to get all these, I hope. Let's see. Come on, it's just running in a straight line. Yeah, we could definitely get that. And then... We should be able to... Oh, I was hoping that we'd be able to just jump straight into it. Okay, how many more do we need? Probably not very more. Two more. Okay, very nice. Wait, there also is an underwater area here that I actually do want to get to. Because I want to see if that enemy has been replaced. I'm guessing it has been replaced. In Super Pokemon Odyssey, it was replaced. And it looked super cool. So I want to see what it will be in this game, in Super Zelda Odyssey. Okay, let's see. So we've got these cheap cheeps. You know what? Let's capture a cheap cheap. Come here. Come here. Okay, let's capture one of these. Capture it, please. There we go. Okay, I am now one of these fish. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. It's spin around like this. Okay, now there are going to be some jump scares. Get ready, guys. Get ready, guys. Ready for the jump scare? Oh, look at that. Okay, that actually isn't too scary. It looks a little bit skinny. It reminds me of The Legend of Zelda Wind Waker, actually. Wait, hold on. Is there a moon somewhere back here that I'm forgetting about? I vaguely, whoop, I vaguely remember that there is a moon somewhere around here. Kind of hidden moon. If you look backwards, you can get it. Lots of these guys over here. Uh-oh, I am almost dead. Imagine if I died here. That'd be very sad, wouldn't it? A heart. Do that. Hooray! Now we're not going to immediately die. Now it'll take us two hits to die. Uh, anything up here? At least one power moon, please? Wait. Why is there just a pipe? Where does the pipe take us? Is there a power moon behind me? Tell me there's a power moon behind me. Oh, we're just up here. Well, we could have gotten up here in a much easier way. We could have just probably not used the send, but we could have 
used one of the NPCs to bounce us up here. Blow me up! And we just need one more power moon. So let's see where we could go get a nice power moon. Is there a power moon under that dory over there? I think that maybe there would be. Let's see if we could run to over there. Oh, you know what? Let me grab another one of these so we can go nice and fast. And bring me down here. Bring me down here. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on, 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 come on. Just let me go, just let me go. And hey! Do you not have a power moon underneath your belly over here? I Wait, you do! Oh! I thought that there normally was one over here, but yeah, this thing looked bigger than normal. So I guess the power moon was just hidden inside there. Good thing that I knew that it was there, but now that's enough power moon, so now we can just teleport back to the Odyssey and go to the next kingdom. And what's up next? I'm guessing maybe the Luncheon Kingdom is next. The Luncheon Kingdom will be a fantastic one with these power-ups. And I'm gonna try and use some of the other power-ups, because this one we haven't really used too much. And we haven't really used this one either, so I'll try and use one or both of those. Okay, so I just went for a run outside, actually, and now it is time to continue along with this kingdom. Wait, 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 I just got an idea. Wait, where's this? This is over here. Can I just send up here? Let me ascend. And that's so funny that we could just ascend up like that. That is way too funny that we could do that. Oh man, that's hilarious. Okay, now let's see, where can we go get some more power moons? I guess we could go get some power moons over there. That should be a nice place for some power moons. Right over here should be a great place. Okay, but I don't think I can ascend here, can I? Because this isn't really sticking out. Yeah, that isn't really sticking out. So the way that we have to go is like this. Then we can, ah! I don't know if a triple jump takes you higher than a backflip. Yeah, because with a triple jump, I can make it up no problem, but with the other jumps, I was having a little bit of difficulty with it. Okay, but anyways, we got that power moon, which is nice. Piled on the salt. Okay, where are we going next? Let's come down this way. Hey there, friends. Don't mind me, I'm just coming over here. Oh, that was so weird, seeing those actual tomato guys. Those tomato guys weren't replaced with other enemies. That's kind of funny that they weren't replaced. Okay, now let me just come up here. Wait, can I not ascend here? Oh, there we go. Now we're ascending. Okay, there we go. We made it up. Okay, I thought that's so strange. It's taking us a while to ascend. Okay, well, let's come over here because now there's going to be a boss fight. It's going to be one of the last... Actually, one of the last brutal boss fights. So we're up against this guy again. Let's throw Cappy at him. There we go. Got a nice jump on him. And I wonder... Whoa! Hey! He broke free! It looked like he was maybe being frozen in place there. The Hey! I thought that would freeze him in place, but it just made him go the other way. That's kind of funny. I actually wasn't expecting that. Okay, now where are you going? Come. Come. Come to the center. Come. Come. Let's go throw that at him. Dive on him. There we go. Okay, now come here, my friend. Come here. Come this way. Come. I'm ready for you. I'm ready for you. There we go. We got him. We got him. Very good. Okay, now let's just get him like this and jump on him. And there we go. Now he's defeated, and we should be able to get this power moon very easily. Just please explode, my little Zelda monster. My little Zelda munchkin. There we go, you are gone, and... There's a lovely power moon here for us. Let's just get that. There we go. Okay, so let's drop down here, because there's a nice power moon that we could get in here easily. The one that is... Whoa! Boy, we burned, we burned, not good. Okay, but we got it. Now, can we get out of here? Let's see. Let me out of here, let me out of here, let me out of here, and... Okay, nice. That's such a quick one to get in that sub area, and then you can just leave. Now, wait. Can I ascend to here? No, because that isn't lined up with that. Oh, that's so sad that we can't just ascend like that. Because to ascend, you need something directly above you. And also, not very far above you for it to work. Man, Link's movement is pretty funny in this. Oh my, what's that smell? Delicious. Okay, well, let's see. Where is the... I thought that this was a shiny spot here. No, but this isn't the shiny spot. The shiny spot's somewhere else. Okay, we want to get up here. Go! And right there is the power moon. That's nice that we could get that. Very nice. Very, very, very nice. And... There are a lot of power moons that you could get around here, actually. Let's see. There's a nice one. It's right up here. My movement here is a bit weird. I don't know if people normally go this way or what. Oh no, but my motion controls aren't working right now, so hold on, let's just come down like this. Let's just go like that with Cappy. There we go, and that worked. Now we can get up without too much trouble, I think. Oh wait, I wonder if I could use one of these on the boxes to destroy the boxes. Probably not. I don't know if I could even aim at them. 
I don't think that I can do that. Can I zap this guy? What if I use this on you? Yeah, I could just shoot lightning at that fork over there, but I don't think that he really cares. I should try using this on a normal enemy and seeing what happens if we do that to them. Oh wait, but there are two kind of interesting things to get over here. Let's first come here. We can just make our way over to this one right there, because there's a power moon here for us. Perfect. I drop a column in a row. And then, oh, I just kicked all those around, but what we need is, I guess, the center one? Yep, that's the golden one. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I wonder if this will work. What if we use our hand ability to move it? What if we go like this? Pick that up. Go up. Oh, the way that it moves is kind of weird. Come to me. Whoa, I don't want to speak to this person while I'm holding this. That's so weird. Okay, if I bring it to me. Whoa, it ended up above me. Okay, these turnips can get kind of weird when you hold them. Wait, we bring them up. Oh, if I try and bring it up, then I end up holding it. If I throw it, then it just goes like this. Where did it go? Where did it go? Okay, you know what? Before I lose this golden turnip for good, I'm throwing it in there. All I know is that turnips are a little bit glitchy when you try to use that hand ability on them. Let's just grab this power moon. And only a few more power moons to go. We're actually making incredible progress. Very happy with how this is going. Let's grab this guy who's also not changed. This is one of the kingdoms. It so far looks the most like Super Mario Odyssey because a bunch of the other kingdoms we've had all kinds of wild and wacky enemies. But today, well, can I get up from this side? I wonder if we can get high enough here. Not sure if we can. Where's that? Oh, man, we can make it up from here. I didn't even know that we can make it up from this side. Okay, well, that's nice. Wait, and there's going to be a piece of cheese over here blocking this door. I wonder if we could use... Oh, no. Oh, we can. We can. I was going to say we can't, but we can. Okay, let's go in here then. We're not allowed to be in here yet. Oh, oh, wait a minute. Whoa. Whoa, look at the fireballs. I remember these guys from, uh, I think from, wait, no, I was gonna say Twilight Princess, but I don't know if these guys are in Twilight Princess or in Breath of the Wild. Okay, well, there's gotta be, uh, gotta be something that we need around here somewhere. Wait, do I want to get up here, actually? Oh, yes, there's one. Yeah, there's one. Okay, that's an easy one. Okay, but I think there are actually also those other things that you need to get. Yeah, if you could collect all of the moon shards, but you know what? I think that is too much work to look for all those. We can get easier power moons. Let's go for some other power moons instead. Okay, we want to go over there. Let's get... Get this. Let's see if we can zap these guys and freeze them. Are you frozen? Are you frozen? Let's freeze somebody. Here, come. Come. Are you ready to be frozen? I'll freeze you. I'll freeze you, bro. I'll freeze you, bro. You ready? You ready, bro? Come, come. I'm gonna freeze you. I'm gonna freeze you. Ready? Freeze. Freeze. I freeze these guys? Fine! Oh, those guys got defeated, okay. Well. There, I zapped you. Are you gonna stop now? No, it looks like he's still moving. What does that ability even do? Okay, well, let's try another one. Let's try this. There. Should be zapped now. Are you gonna stop? I don't know if this ability is doing anything. Wait! Wait, what in the world is going on? Can I control him or what? What What was going on? That was so strange. I don't know what happened with him. It almost seemed like he was starting to attack the other guy. Where are you going? Why are you jumping back? What's going on? Okay, you know what? Whoop. I'm gonna go like that to defeat you. That's fine because you are confusing me so I will destroy you. Okay, but we actually do need one of those guys that are... Th Whoa, you're back already. Okay, well, we actually do need one of you. So let's go like this. And I can just defeat you with this. We want to come up here. We want to destroy these. Oh. Okay, good, good, good. Everything's still okay. Okay, let's pop out now. Throw that there. And now we can get going this way. Link looks like he's about to face plant right now. Guys, do any of you know how to do flips? Oh boy, going to classes like gymnastics or parkour where you could learn how to do flips is so incredibly fun. It is so good to have a good instructor for doing something like that. Doing flips is so much fun. Okay, so now we got that power moon. So now this stuff is coming up. Wait! Wait, I wonder. I really wonder something. I've got to test this out. Wait! Okay, that is still there. Okay, I was wondering if this would be here or not. Well, first, let's knock this guy off. Normally, what you want to do is capture a lava bubble, and then you could set this on fire. What if we go like this? Yeah, I guess this fireball doesn't actually set this on fire. 
in the Super Mario Odyssey with elements, with the avatar added to the game, with the four avatar elements added to the game, you actually can light that on fire with your fire breath, which is super cool. But with this mod, that fireball ability doesn't actually set that on fire, which is too bad. It is so sad, in fact. So sad. But there is a power moon right around there for us that we should be able to get to. I was not sure if I would land there or not. That was actually a little bit scary. Nice that we made it here. Can we make it back safely too or are we dying? Let's see. Come on over here. And look at this, we're already back up here. Wow, that's wild. I thought that we would fall down and that we'd have to make our way back to there. Move, Spidey! Give me this. Come on up, beautiful. And come here. Beautiful. Perfect, perfect, absolutely perfect. Okay, now let's just jump around like this. But wait, 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 we still need one more power moon after this. We're not gonna have enough power moons. Wait, and what is this bird that's coming for us? Hold on, let's watch this bird that's gonna be coming for us. Ah, that's the bird from, is it Wind Waker? It's Wind Waker, right? This has to be from The Legend of Zelda Wind Waker. Oh my goodness. I remember this bird. I'm thinking that it is Wind Waker because I do remember seeing this bird in a Zelda game that I played as a kid. Or a bird that looked a lot like this at least. It must be this bird. Okay, so let's just make our way right there and get that power moon easily. Very nice. It's so funny that there's some kind of path that you're meant to follow to get to that, but you can just do a backflip and use Cappy to get up here to this power moon. Okay, so now this bird is angry. So it is going to flap its wings and create a bunch of wind that pushes us off here. Oh, look at like his head is coming off. That's how strong the wind is there. Okay, so we need one more power moon. Where can we go? Wait, did I not get any of the checkpoint flags? Okay, there's a checkpoint flag up here that I got. I think there should probably be a power moon that we could get to pretty easily around there somewhere. Whoa. Whoa, let me just come here. And wait, 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 hold on. I know that there's a power moon somewhere up here if you ground pound around here, but I think that might be just a post-game power moon. Not one that just regularly appears. Okay, so let's just jump up here. Then I think there's a nice power moon that we could get around here. Oh yeah, we could just get this treble clef one over here. And I think there are one or two other power moons around there that we could also get, but let's just go for this one. We should be able to get this one, I think. Wow, it's actually looking very bright over here, brighter than usual. There's another area that was looking darker than usual, which is kind of funny. Oh, okay, and that's all of them, right? Okay, good, that is all of them. Very nice, so now we can just grab this. Let's just grab it, Link, there we go. And now we can get out of here and go to the next kingdom because now we should have enough power moons, perfect. Okay, so Cappy says that we're going to the Bowser kingdom right now, but first, before that, we are actually getting attacked. And who's it gonna be? It's getting up here on top of a dragon. And wait, the dragon looks different, actually. Who's this dragon going to be? That looks so good! I think that is one of the coolest replacements for a dragon that we have ever seen. Its wings look incredible. That is so cool. Let's see who survived this plumber boy. I can't imagine Ganon ever saying that in any context. Oh boy, look at Link getting zapped over there. And down goes the Odyssey getting destroyed for a second time. That dragon looks way too good. Okay, so we want to make our way over to this boss fight, and you know what, I think water might actually be a good idea against this boss fight. Wait, where's the boss? Is the boss gonna come up? I actually wanna see it come up because this boss looks really cool. Look at that! Oh my goodness, it's like some kind of bone dragon. It reminds me of, wait, is it Hooktail or Bone Tail or something? It's probably called Bone Tail. Hooktail is probably the first boss in a Paper Mario the Thousand Year Door. Wait, will water protect me from this or no? Oh, well, I didn't get hit by it anyway, so that's fine. Are you gonna attack again? Let's see. I, ah, we do get hurt. Oh, and our water bubble isn't even gone. Wait, will water protect us from this? The electricity? Yeah, electricity should be super effective against water. The water doesn't even protect us here. Okay, go there. Get that, get that, get that. And there we go. Okay, barely got the first hit on him, actually. That's a little scary. This looks like it might not go very well. This looks like it might be a bit of a difficult boss fight, actually. Okay, going pretty well so far. Okay, give me another one of those attacks and come here. Okay, good, good, good. Now you guys are out of the way. Okay, now let's get ready. I'm gonna stay kind of close here. 
Let's see. And... Get up onto this guy. Don't bonk there, bro. Don't bonk there. Don't bonk there. Don't bonk there. Get up here. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Go, 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 go. And... Come here. And there we go. Okay, got the hit before it became electric. That's good. Two hits so far. Looking like it might be good. Let's see. As long as these don't cause too much of an issue. Okay, very nice. Are you doing that again or are you dropping down? Oh, now you're just dropping down. Okay. Let's see. I got zapped. I got zapped. Okay, get me up here. Nice. Nice, 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 nice. Very nice that we were able to make it up. Get that one now. Good, good, good. I'll get these three. Come on, come on, come on. One more, one more, one more. And get the ground pound. Oh my goodness, it didn't even start to turn, Zappy, and I already got the ground pound. That's incredible. I was worried that I wouldn't have enough time there. That's why I tried to rush. I tried to get on, and I thought, you know what, I'll take some damage, but I just want to get onto the dragon quickly so I could get rid of those swords so that I could damage it. But that ended up working out great. Okay, let's just put a water bubble around us now. And... That's so funny! Look at that! We had, the camera was basically inside the water bubble over there for a moment, and the water bubble's still down there. Uh, it's so much fun to do stuff like this in games and to see what happens, but we now have enough Power Moons to restore the Odyssey, and we'll be able to go to the Bowser Kingdom, which will be the second last kingdom. Wait, I wonder what Ascend is going to be like in the Moon Kingdom, or am I going to have to use the uh, moon jump that is typically done off of the Sphinx? Okay, let's do the Bowser Kingdom. Wow, I actually didn't know that you could make it up here right at the start like that. That's actually pretty funny that we did that. Okay, you know what? Let's try using some abilities that we haven't used on these guys. What if I use lightning on you? Whoa! Oh! Oh! Everyone that walks into it is destroyed! I had no idea that this ability was so powerful! I might just accidentally defeat a bunch of Goombas if I don't even mean to do it. I can just go like this and BAM! Lightning just destroys them all and then when they come here- ah, it Disappeared right when I was about to walk into it! What's going on with that? It's like they planned that. How did they do that? Hey, but otherwise- wait, 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 what is this? What is this? What is this little guy? Oh, he's got a little pitchfork! That's so funny! That's such a cool way to do this instead of its nose poking up, because normally these are called Pokios, and their nose pokes out, and that's how they stick onto the wall. They have a little pitchfork. That's so interesting. Wow, just a cupcake made a great decision for choosing what would replace Pokios. Okay, let's continue on then. And wait, is there any other ability? We haven't really used this ability too much. Wait! Wait, is that guy- okay, that guy isn't changed over there. Okay, I was thinking that maybe that guy was changed. Let's go like this. Let's grab these. Oh, and maybe I could have used some ability to take out these guys to make collecting that easier. Oh, and the moon is back there. Okay, so let's go like this. Protect me, water! Oh, oh, and I got hit right away after that. I mean, while I turned invincible, it looked like my water shield came on. Hold on, will this defeat these guys? Yeah, that can defeat those guys too! Oh my goodness, okay, so that would have been useful about a moment ago. Okay, now what about you? Where are you going? Oh, I wonder if I could use Ascend to get up through that guy. I think that would be a funny way to do that, but... Give me the Power Moon. Okay, I am in place for the Power Moon, right? 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 Yes! Okay, that's so cool that I was able to get there before the Power Moon spawned. Let's keep going! Okay, and hold on, I don't think the Power Moon is back here, right? I always think that, right? Okay, yeah, I always check there and I go, nope, that's not where the Power Moon is. The Power Moon is later on still. Now then, what shall we do over here? Is this- oh, this is where we need to collect these. Okay, so let's get that right there. That's beautiful. Okay, now hold on, is there something up- oh, I can't grab onto that while I see. Okay, but be able to get this guy here. Now hold on, do we want to come up here? Whoop, let's go like this. Go like that. I want to come up. You know what? Can I just ascend? Hey, don't explode me. Can I ascend here? Yes, and... Beautiful! Beautiful! We made it all the way up there. Okay, that was the time where ascend was actually useful because now we got to get that and that saved us a fraction of a moment. Oh, wait, wait, wait. There's also the one, uh, back there. I remember there being one somewhere around a torch somewhere. Hold on, where in the world could that be? Okay, wait, let's see. Let's explode that one. Okay, there's one, and then we need to go over there. We need to stick our pitchfork in here. Normally, you just stick your nose in there, and then you can get that. Let's go. Just get up. There we go. Now, hold on. Where's the final one? The final moon shard. 
Wasn't it over some kind of torch or something? Or in some area down somewhere? I remember it was somewhere back here, but where could it have been? Hold on, was it back here? Oh, it's way back there, isn't it? Yeah, I never checked that area back there. That's where I haven't been. Okay, can I please do a long jump to get to there? Thank you very much. And good job getting that, Cappy. Okay, now I don't actually have to go that way. Now I can just turn around, right? Right? And... Whoa! Oh no, oh no, because I already started ground putting. Okay, and you're in my way. You're in the way. You're in the way. Come here! There we go, my lightning shell destroy you. That's such a cool move, that lightning attack. Okay, now let's see. Should I ascend here? You know what? I think ascending here is a good idea. Let us ascend! I'll make it up here. Perfect. Okay, that's a little bit slow, but it is so cool to do that. It's so cool to be able to ascend like that. Power moon. Where's the power moon? Come on, there we go. Got the power moon. Okay, now hold on. Is this where the power moon is going to be? Do we want to ascend up here? Let's try ascending here. Bring me up here, please. Ascend is such a cool ability. I just can't get over what a cool ability ascend is. Not only in Tears of the Kingdom, but also in Super Mario Odyssey. Man, I never thought that I would be using the ascend ability in Super Mario Odyssey. Just absolutely changing this game. It, this is completely changing the game. It's unbelievable, the things that people are adding to this game. Okay, so we've got two bosses. Over here we've got the one bunny boss, and over here we've got the... Well, okay, good, good, good. I was worried that it would crash. But nope, we've still got some brutals to take on. <laughs> it's so funny to see these guys and hear the sounds they make. The way they move around is pretty funny, too. Water might be a good idea against you. Will it bounce back? It doesn't bounce back to you. Uh-oh, that's bad. That's bad. What if I go like this? Yes! Okay, I can make it bounce back to you if I move slightly to the side. Now, where are you going? Where are you going? Where are you going? Where are you going? Over there? Bam! Got you! Nice try! Nice try, but I gotcha! Gotcha! Let's get this on. A step a bit to the side. Oh, I missed. I don't think I could send that one back either. Okay, let's get some more water. Give me water! Oh boy, I just put on the water at the last possible second. Now let's see, just stand back like this. And will that go? Okay, that works. I got the hit onto you. There we go, there's another hit on you. Now where are you going? Where are you going? I'm gonna run that way, wherever you go. I'm coming there! Okay, I got you. I got you. I got you, are you ready? I've got, I've got a water bubble here. I'm not afraid to use it. Come. And there we go! That's so cool that if you have the water bubble, it bounces back. When the boss is throwing just one of the spiky balls, it bounces right back onto it if you don't move, which is pretty cool. But when it's throwing two, it ends up bouncing a bit to the side like that, which is what I was worried would happen, and it did happen. Okay, now let's give this boss a try. Wait, I actually want to try this lightning attack. I wonder if this will work. Oh. Oh! Oh, it actually knocks the hats off! That was actually really cool. Okay, but let's see, which one is it? Is it this one right here? Oh, I actually thought that was the one. Okay, I got the wrong one. Uh-oh, that's not good. That's not good. Well, you know what? Maybe we could put some lightning down. Go! And... Oh, that's so cool that those, they run into that. Wait, 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 wait. The lightning attack might actually be perfect on this guy while he has all those hats. Okay, don't come to me. Come to me. Now go. Yes! Yes! Look at that! Look at that! The way that it knocks all of his hats off, that is actually a great opportunity to do that. Okay, now let's see. Wait. See this one? Ah, I got it wrong again! Oh, that is so sad! So sad! Okay, I was thinking of actually using the fireball ability here, but I actually really like how the lightning ability works. Because, uh, you know what? The fire ability might be better when all those guys are moving around. But I think the lightning ability might be great. When he is in this stage. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Let me do one more. Let me do one more. Let me do one more. Oh no! Oh no, because there's a bit of a cool down on this ability, so you can't just spam it all the time. Let's see, where are you? Right there. Are you defeated now? I think you might be defeated. Okay, there we go. That was a cool boss fight. It's so sweet to have these abilities against these bosses. And it really does feel like you're playing a pretty different game. I have played through Super Mario Odyssey a few times, obviously nowhere near as many times as some speedrunners who have played through this game very many times, but this game still feels so fresh when you're constantly playing new mods and so many major changes are made to the game through mods like this. Okay, so let's start to make our way through here. And come to me, come to me, thank you very much. I can't grab onto that, can I? No, because that is metal there. We can't do that. Let's come on to here. Oh, and that is water there. Oh, wait, but I probably wanted to use that guy to get up onto here, but that's fine, because we can just go like this. And nice, now we're up here. 
Look out, bros. Look out, bros. Look out, bros. Don't hurt me. I'll send you away. Hey! I guess I can't hit those away with Happy. I probably have to use one of those guys down there. Oh, wait, wait, wait. We want to bring this guy over here. Come, 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 come. Come here. Come here, my friend. Come. Very good. Okay, now you broke that. Now I can grab that power moon. And that'll be perfect. That's exactly what I need. And wait, can I ascend up anywhere there? I don't think I can ascend if I stand there. I don't think there's anything that I can reach. Hey, let's try it. Let's try it. Let's come here. And ascend. No, there's nothing around here that I can ascend to. That is so sad. So sad. Okay, bro, move. Move. Get out of my way. You're in the way. Okay, where is this guy? Let me catch this guy. Now flick me up here. I'd like to climb up, please. Hey, sir. Please get out of my way so I can climb up here. I'd like to climb up here, please. I'd like to make my way up here. Barely making my way over. Can I reach up there? Nope, that is too high without a little flick. Me up here, that'll be perfect. Nope, I'm back over here again. That's fine. As if you can't shake the controller, you can't get as far, really. Nice when you get, because it seems like when you shake the controller, you actually can move quite a bit farther. Right now, my controller shake isn't working. Because my controller isn't, I guess, connected or whoa, recognized properly. Okay, but there we go. There we go. We got that. So that's very nice. And now, be able to make it up to here. Let's just go like that just to be sure that we can make it. Okay, now let's pop out of that guy. That guy was a nice little help. And now, we can just get this and go on up to Bowser. And, oh, before we face Bowser, we're going to have to face, well, I guess instead of Bowser, it is Ganon. Before we face him... We're gonna have to face the Mecha Brutal boss fight. So let's see what's going on with Ganon over here. Oh, oh my goodness! Look at the way he's holding Zelda! He's holding Zelda like she's a sword! <laughs> she's extending out her arm as if that's the blade of the sword, which is pretty funny. Ah, oh, it's so funny. I keep forgetting that we actually have Zelda instead of Princess Peach in this game. That's such a great change. If this was Super Pokemon Odyssey, who should... Princess Peach be replaced with maybe Misty? Or who would be appropriate? Okay, so Ganon wants to go to the moon. It looks like he's holding the hat in his mouth. Link wants to make it to the airship over there. He jumps up, Bowser punches him away with the hat, and Link falls down, and we're gonna have a different boss fight now. Off to the moon they go. This was my favorite part of Breath of the Wild, when Ganon's ship sailed to the moon with Zelda. And it's time for us to face off against the Mecha Brutal boss fight. And you know what? This almost seems like the kind of boss fight. Oh. Wait. Wait, 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 wait. Can I just ascend up you? Yes. Yes. Wait. No, why did you bring me back down? I'd like to ascend. Let me ascend. Where am I? Where am I? Why am I stuck in here? Why am I just floating right there? Let me down. Let me down. Okay, brought me out, okay. If we could ascend send up this guy, that'd be amazing. Come on, come on, where am I? Where am I? How am I inside here? Uh-oh, uh-oh, hey! Hey, you guys gotta stay back. You guys gotta stay back, cause you know what I'm doing? I'm ascending up here, okay? I'm ascending up here. Me up here? Hey, can I? Get up through here? Yes, I can! Okay, very good. I can make it up here. Okay, now let's see. Let's just ground pound on some of these guys. And I, I'd i like to make it back, please! Yes, I made it back onto this. Okay, now let's see. Take a step. Ah, oh, come on, come on, come on, come on. Let me ground pound on this guy. And there we go, there we go. We got another one, okay. Let's see. Come on, let me back up and... Hey! You're getting angry! You're getting angry because I shouldn't be doing attacks like that. That's why you're getting angry, is it? No, actually, they just get angry like that all the time. Regardless of whether you do cheats like that or not. Okay, now let's see, let's see. I'd like to ascend up through the boss again, please. Are you done being all sparkly and stuff? Very good. Now let me ascend, please. Very good. Okay, and now? Up here. You know, I'm inside you. Okay, good, good, good. I made it up here. Okay, now let's see. Should I go for this one? Because this one would probably be the easiest. Wait. Yes, I got that one. Okay, can I make it back up? That is the question. Come on. Yes. Come on. Come on. Come on. Let me back up. Come on. No! What even hurt me? That's so unfair. No! No, 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 no,
to, uh, I've got to go get that heart over there from that rock. I'd love to just go and ascend up into that guy. Hey, give me this, give me this. Ah, those sparkler things that spin around, those are so annoying. Go crush some of them so I can go ascend. Come on, come on, come on, let me ascend, let me ascend. Stop moving around, stop moving around, just stand there. Stay, 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 stay. Stand there, stand there. Let me ascend, let me ascend, let me ascend, let me ascend. Why can I not ascend? Let me ascend. Yes! That's what we need, that's what we need, that's what we need. Now let's see. No! No, 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 no! Ah, man, it started shining like that and I thought, oh no, I'm gonna be in trouble, aren't I? I'm going to be in trouble, I think. Uh, let's see, what can we do? What can we do? Okay, keep shooting up those, that's good. And now wait. Descend. Let me ascend. Go up! Yes! And? Yes, I made it up all the way to the top somehow! Okay, nice! Now just let me grab up. No! Don't launch me off. Okay, come on, come on, come on. Just stop moving for a moment. Stop moving for a moment. Stop moving for a moment. Move! No! No, it pushed me off! Come on! Come on, stop spinning around. No, don't long jump off. Come on, I just need this final hit. No, 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 no. Go, go. Come on, nope. Ah, bro, come on, come on. I had so many chances there to get it. It's so difficult. Okay, let's see, let's see. Are you gonna stop in a moment? Stop, stop, stop. Stop, yes, yes, perfect. Now come, let me do this, let me ascend. We make it up, and how high up can we go? I ended up in some weird part of it. It seems like I ended up in that thing between its legs. It seems like you can ascend up to different parts, depending on where you use ascend from. So you have to be careful where you are standing when you use ascend. So I should probably go like this. Maybe now we'll go up higher. Yes! Okay, perfect. And are you defeated now? Are you actually defeated? Is that the last one? There we go. Now it is defeated. Okay, great. Towards the end of the boss, I found out what was the most efficient way to use Ascend against the boss. And there we go. Now it's defeated. I don't know what that is in the background, though. It almost looks like a gem. Oh, man. What a relief that we got this multi-moon. And now we can go to the Moon Kingdom, the final kingdom of the game. And we'll finally be able to save Princess Zelda. Hey, do we have enough power moons for the next kingdom? Oh, you only need eight more. Okay, and we have 11. Okay, so that is plenty. I always get more power moons than necessary because I can never remember how many power moons you need for this kingdom. But yeah, that is plenty. It's better to have more than not enough, I guess. Okay, so we are at the moon kingdom. And it's kind of nice that we now have moon gravity so that we can make wild jumps like this one here. We could just make a long jump across like that. Make a long jump across like this. And let's see if we will be able to ascend up to where we want to go, if we can do that shortcut, or if we will have to do the Sphinx skip, as is normally done in speedruns. I think it's normally done in speedruns. I believe that it's a speedrun skip that is still used, or at least at some point was used, because it seems like it is a lot faster. Whoa, look at that guy. That's not who that normally is. That looks like a Zelda character. Okay, so let's see. Can we ascend up to there or no? don't think there's really anything that sticks out, so we might have to do this jump the way that it's normally done. Okay, so let's see if I still know how to do this. We go like this, bounce off a of Cappy there, jump off of that wall, come over here. Ah, I didn't get the jump on that wall that I wanted. Oh, that's too bad. Can we ascend around here? How high will this bring us? Oh, yes, 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 let me pop out here, let me pop out here. I'd like to drop down there, please. Where am I? No! Don't bring, me, don't bring me back to here. Wait, what if I come in a little bit more? And I send up just like this? Come on. Come on, come on, come on. We're so close. I'd love to just pop out and go forward there. Come on. Where are we? Where are we? Ah, so close. Because I don't want to accidentally go in there. Because I don't want to trigger that area. I'd love to just come up here. And just end up there. Ah. How close can I get? Does that work? Come on. And where are we now? Where? What the? No, I didn't want to fall in here. No. Oh, wait. Can I just take this pipe back up? Am I allowed to just exit? 
Oh, that's so great! I thought that I'd be stuck in there forever! Oh, that's lovely, that's amazing! Watch out, the hole back there is real deep. Got it, Toad, thank you. Thank you for the warning, okay. Walk up to... There, so. Now I should be able to ascend up, right? Ah, oh, come on! Come on! Just let me go here, look. Oh, and I fell beneath the level. Right? Yeah, okay, I did. Wait! Yes! Yes, 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 yes! We made it up! Oh, man, I was so worried there. I thought, uh-oh, we started sliding. And then after we started sliding, I thought, oh, great, now we're gonna fall down here again. Okay, the way that Link rolls is also really weird. Look at the way that he rolls. That is just so strange. He's got some very strange rolling here. Okay, but we can head in here now. Okay, so that's not bad that we were able to do that. Okay, and now we're gonna have an interesting boss fight coming up. So let's just make our way through here. And... Oh, look at Link bursting through the door, standing over there, almost like he's T-posing. And it is Zelda and Ganon. The eyes almost look like they're on the pot back there, which is kind of funny. Wait, wait, and you know what else we could do while we are here? Also, grab one of these guys, you come over here. And we should be able to get infinite height like this. Kind of funny, how high can we go? Let's see. Let's see, you just bring me up, bring me up, bringing me up. Okay, I guess that's the ceiling. You can't go any higher than that. Hold on. I'm down a bit. Now let's come back up here and... Oh, now all of a sudden we're down here. Isn't that so funny that once you make it past a certain X or Z... Wait, why are her arms crossed like that? She's going, no, no, I don't want to get married right now. <laughs> it's almost as if that's what she's showing with her arms crossed like that. Why is she reaching out like that? Are you trying to swim? What is going on? Oh, man. The rigging's kind of funny. Yeah, now it looks like she's trying to sleep. Okay, he stomps his foot. We fall down. Wait, there's no dialogue. Why was there no dialogue? Isn't there normally dialogue over there? What happened to the dialogue? There's normally dialogue, isn't there? I was just laughing about how funny that looked. But isn't there dialogue? I think there's normally dialogue there, right? And down comes Ganon. Time for our boss fight. Whoa, I want water. Is this my water one? Let's see. No, that's not water. That's wind. Okay, I want water. Let's go, water! Yeah! The water bubble protects us. Okay, now where are you going, bro? Huh? Where are you going, Ganon, my bro? The Ganon, bro? Where are you going? The Ganon dwarf, it's Ganon, bro. Go! I am almost dead. I have one HP. I actually have to be careful for the rest of the boss fight, because I don't want to do this again. I don't want to do this again. I hope I don't die. I'll actually be a little bit careful. Okay, so I'll put on this. Hopefully this water will protect us from the fire attack. But, I think what's even more important is actually trying to avoid it and making sure that I don't get burned by that. Okay, now, when he sends out these other caps over here, I might actually try and hit some of them. Oh, wait, 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 then I lose that. Uh-oh. Give me that! Okay, 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 at least we didn't die. At least I got healed for a moment. That's all right, that's all right. Let's see. Hey, where is that one? Uh, heart maybe, heart maybe. Heart maybe! Okay, at least we're dead this early in the fight, not at the very end of the fight. Okay, let's get back to the fight. So here's the first hit on Ganon. Okay, let's just jump over him like that. There we go. That'll teach you. It certainly will, won't it? And that right, Cappy. Let's see if the water will protect us from the fire. I'm curious. Okay, it does not. The water does not protect us at all from the fire. We just get burned, and the bubble didn't get used up even. Okay, so now let's see. Where are we going? Where are we going next? Where are we going next? Give me that one. That's the one that I want. The one that I want. Okay, let's see. We won't get in to go for there. And... Very nice. Whoa! Keep your spiky balls away from me, Mr. Ganon. And... Those are some nice hits on you. Now what? How many tail swings you got, huh? Oh, I thought I would step too close to him and that we would get hurt there, but that's fine. Good to know that we are all right. I wonder if we could pick up Ganon and move Ganon. That'd be really cool if we could do that. Hey, good thing we didn't get hurt by the fire. That's very good to know. Oh, no, he's going again. He's going again. I was not expecting that. Are you done or no? Oh, huh? more fire? More fire? You haven't had enough? Haven't had enough, bro? You haven't had enough, bro, have you? You know what? I want... Take one of these hats. I'm gonna take that hat right there. I'm gonna release it now. Oh man, these hats are wild the way they're chasing after me. Okay, at least we're at full health. 
Wait, I want to pick up Ganon. I want to pick up Ganon. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. Hey, go! Go! Yes! Yes, 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 yes. There we go, there we go, there we go. Okay, now we can defeat him. Now we can defeat him. Let's see. Let's see. Where are you going? Where are you going, my little prey? My little prey that I am hunting after. I shall get you! You shall be destroyed. Oh, and, and, something really cool should happen when we get to the 2D section, when we can play as Bowser. Oh, 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 and there's one more jump over there. And now we can defeat him right there we go. Goodbye, Ganon. Everyone say goodbye, Ganon. Please comment goodbye, Ganon, everybody. Oh, his head is even gone. And Princess Zelda is now freed from the ring. It's so weird seeing Zelda in this game. This is actually so strange, seeing Princess Zelda in this game. <laughs> She's almost T-posing as she comes down. Whoa, she put her hand through her hand. Princess Zelda, are you alright? You shouldn't be doing that with your hands. And now cubes are coming down. Game cubes. Zelda looks like she's ready to do some karate chops. There she goes, I'm gonna karate chop any cubes that come down here. Ganon is still missing his head! Okay, but down come the cubes. And what's gonna happen? The floor cracks now because all these cubes are raining down. And the floor collapses and down we all go. Okay, so we want to go and capture Bowser right now, actually. And by Bowser, I mean Ganon. What are we going to do? You know what? I have an idea of what we're gonna do. We're gonna... Pick you up, and I'm gonna move you here. Wait, I can't really move you because you're on a rail. I'll just leave you. Can I move Ganon? I can move Ganon. And, hold on. Can I move him here? Yes, we can get infinite height with Ganon. Maybe we can just make it over here. If we go high enough. Is that a ceiling or can we go through it? Oh, it's just a ceiling. Okay, that's fine, let's drop down. Okay, that's fine. Let's leave him here. And I wonder if with any of our abilities, if we could smash our way through here with fire, can we break through these? With fire, we could break through these. That's so funny that you could actually destroy these with the fireball. We haven't used the fireball too much, even though it's a really cool ability. But you know what? We do want to capture... Wait, where are you? There he is. There we go. We're getting him now. Oh, this is so funny seeing Link get sucked up into Ganon like that. Wow, that's not something that happens every day. Wow, and you even have Link in this cutscene instead of Mario, that's so cool. But we have a bunch of old Bowsers instead of old Ganons, which is kind of funny. But now, we are Ganon, and we have Zelda on our shoulder, which is pretty cool. Let's just make our way through here. We can do slash attacks and fire attacks, which might be a bit different from the attacks that Ganon normally uses. Kind of cool that we have this cape over here. Never thought I'd be playing as Ganon in a game. I guess in Smash Bros. you could play as Ganon. In Super Smash Bros. Melee, you could play as Ganon. And in probably every Smash Bros. game since then. He didn't make it up to there, which is too bad. But, get up here. Let's attack this. Oh, watch out, don't want to get hit by the falling rocks. Watch for falling rocks, as they say. And we're about to get into the 2D section. Okay, let's see if I installed this mod properly, because just a cupcake did something really cool over here. Hopefully we're not invisible. And, yeah, look at that. How cool is that? We are a 2D Ganon like this. And look at what we have on our shoulder. We have the princess over there on our shoulder. How cool is that? I think that that is, whoa, I almost fell. I think that that is such a cool addition. I think that that is such a cool addition to this mod. Oh boy, because this is something that didn't really have to be changed. This could have just been left as just Bowser and it wouldn't have changed the video too much. But I think that that is such a nice addition. So nice to see the effort put into this. Man, just the Cupcake makes fantastic mods. It is so nice to have mods like this to play through with character models change like this and just a con did an incredible amount of work in this mod also with all of the abilities being added in and now it's time for the final room i think in the comments some people have told me that something that some people do when they play through this section is they just stay in the center section and just breathe fire at these that's something that you could do i guess that must be a strategy hold on can we jump up high enough to damage that from here nice yeah, it's so nice when you can breathe fire because that... Oh! And... Oh, no, I didn't hit it. Because you can damage it before you get to it like that. Then you don't have to do as many slashes once you reach it. 
Now let's go to that one. Can I make it? Can I make it? Oh, that's not high enough. Look out! Okay, there we go. I didn't get to breathe too much fire onto this one. And we want to make it to the center. I can't see, I can't see, I can't see. Don't fall, don't fall, don't fall, don't fall, don't fall. Okay, good. There we go. We made it to the center. Okay, now we just have to slash against this cube over here. Why did the GameCube not sell as many copies? Why was the N64 on the Wii so much better in terms of total sales? Okay, let's get in there. And it's time to make it out and see the end of the game. Okay, let's go, let's go. I'm ready to go. Come on. Okay, so off we fly. And who pops out? Let's see who pops out. It looks like Bowser and Peach. Help, ops! Get in! His head is gone. His head got squished into his body. Link's able to stand. Zelda floats down with some really bent arms. Hopefully she's all right. Ganon just has his head knocked inside him like a turtle. Well, I guess turtles don't have their heads knocked inside them. They just hide their heads inside them, but you know what I mean. Okay, Cappy and Cappy's sister just appear from out of nowhere. <laughs> Link is like a scarecrow. I love the way that he's standing. Zelda looks a bit more normal right now. Link's head and neck movement is a bit weird. So is Zelda. Oh, Zelda's ready to karate chop. She's ready to battle against us, isn't she? Link is walking up to her like he's the Hulk or something. But out comes Gen. He goes, look at these flowers I got you. Oh, Link's very afraid. Look at this. He goes, look, I got you a rocket flower. And they're fighting over Zelda's affection. Zelda goes, no, no. Oh, she's ready to karate chop us off. She is ready to, she's ready for some self-defense. Maybe Zelda's been training some Krav Maga or something over here. Zelda walks off. He goes, Cappy, Cappy's sister, let's go back to Earth. Her walking is so strange. It's like, it's her first time walking in high heels. That's what it looks like. And what's she gonna say? Camera zooms in on her. And is Link gonna run back to the ship? They look up. She's waving with her very bent arm, and it becomes straight all of a sudden. <laughs> like, she has a bunch of broken bones in her arm. <laughs> He's walking so straight. <laughs> the way that he has his arm so straight out is so funny. But there we go. Whoa, that's an impressive clip. And he throws Cappy, which is Link's hat. I really recommend you watch my video where we play Super Mario Odyssey only up. It is a very tough challenge with harsh punishments if you make any mistakes. You will love that video if you enjoyed this one. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you have an absolutely amazing day ahead of you. And take care, everybody.